Well, at least it's microwave safe. This is not your average bear. Let's see what makes him tick. Wow, an egg! Let's get cracking. Why don't we collect the yolk? Make some shapes. Fry them up. And then add the rest of the eggs. Give it time to fry up. Add a sausage and roll it up. Now enjoy your new breakfast wrap. Not exactly tasting the rainbow with these Skittles. We could just have a snow day instead. Or we can color them ourselves with edible ink. It's one way to stock up on your favorite color. And you'll have all the colors you need for crafts. Stack up these Skittles in a bottle. Now pour some syrup over them. It eh, should be enough. Don't want it overflowing. Now just give it a squeeze and take a bite. Mm. Hmm. Looks like someone wants to keep the candy lips to themselves. <laughs> of course, candy goes in the mouth, not out. And if you run out of lipstick, the candy lips have got your back. Just add a little heat. And watch your troubles melt away. Now scoop it up and pour into the empty tube. Close it up and give it some time to cool. Now pucker up and try your new lipstick. Unless, of course, you eat it up first. Arr, there be treasure in that candy. Wow. Look, it's a pair of AirPods. Ew. And even better, their container. Mm. It'll be perfect for our next idea. Now, get some huh? Nutella. Mm -hmm. And now it's time to fill her up. Soon you'll have delicious chocolate AirPods. They're the perfect shape for dipping sauce, too. Add some sprinkles and extras while we're at it, too. Let's think outside the box for our next treat. Take a balloon and start pumping it up. Yeah, that should be enough. Now it's ready to fill up with candy. There's room for all kinds of snacks in our big, beautiful balloon. Everyone's coming out for this event. Now add some soda to top it off and start stirring. It's a giant lollipop! Wow! Don't forget, we need to pop that balloon. Good thing everything hardened. Now take a lick. How many licks did you reach the center? <laughs> I'm almost scared to ask. Looks like someone needs a moist towelette. Well, on the bright side, it's free Nutella. And really, there's no such thing as too much Nutella. Keep it cool so that it hardens up. Peel your fingers back, unless you want to eat your own hand. Throw on some scoops of ice cream with all the fixings. That's one way to think outside the cone. Mm. Mm. 
Wow, these delivery services sure are quick. Look, it's a powder, but it won't be a powder for long. Give it time and it's instant chewing gum. Let's take a closer look at this powder, shall we? Add some water and mix it up into gum. It's great if you're in the mood to see some stretching. Of course, what's the point of chewing gum without the chewing? Blow some bubbles while you're at it, too. Let's see, what are you in the mood for? Ooh, slime! And it comes in edible form. Yeah, how else would they know it's sour? Of course, edible or not, slime's also fun to play with. Let's see what we can cook up. Add all sorts of toppings to our concoction. I'm starting to think we've got more <laughs> toppings than slime. That is some excellent goop. Really good squish ratio. Wow. And just wait till you see how it tastes, too. I guess that's one place to store your lollipops. Looks like we're going for a theme here, too. This foot even comes with a pair of sneakers. Those are some big shoes to fill, which means more powder. Time to get ready for our next experiment. Go ahead, sample the candy before we start dipping. Never underestimate the importance of uh -huh. dipping sauce. But for the sake of science, let's try pouring instead. Something tells me she really likes green. Now, all the flavors are more or less mixed yeah. together. But it's time for the taste test. I think she likes it. Of course, science is really about trial and error. Maybe we should try less green next time. Mm, so many cupcakes, so little time! Oh no! Have the cupcakes turned against us? No, it's giving you a secret lollipop. I wonder if it's cupcake flavored. And don't forget, there's a surprise inside. Look, it's dipping powder. Close up the cupcake and take it out for a good lick. When it comes to snacks, she really likes the direct approach. Which explains why there's candy in her hair. But let's add it to a hair clip. Makes it more official. In fact, let's decorate all our clips with treats. I think we can fit five little ones on here. It's a fashion statement, and you'll always have a snack on hand. Hmm? Including some treats in disguise. <laughs> Sweet, horrific stuff. Catch you next time. Someone's got a delivery. Let's see what it is. Ooh, it's a tiny burger. It's bite-sized. Did you have to pay a small order fee? Now that's a big burger! And talk about extra cheese! Hope you saved room for all this candy! Look, there's gummy bears, popcorn, even chocolate macaroons! Hey, what's in the tank? Ooh, soda! Gotta keep hydrated! Besides, 
You need something to wash down all these treats. <laughs> hmm? huh? These potties are smaller, but hey, there's three of them. Complete with a lollipop plunger. And it's great for dipping. So, why don't we try all three at once? Like a candy apple, without the apple. Of course, there's always the direct approach. Ooh, an ostrich egg! A big egg means a big breakfast. Or really, whenever you want eggs. Are you sure you don't want any utensils? Well, why pay for eggs when you can get the chicken? See, we've got an egg, so let's get cracking. Here's an idea. Soak up the yolk and the whites in separate injectors. Now you can make little fried eggs right on the pan. So small, they could be hummingbird eggs. But the important thing is the taste. For some soda lovers, two liters just isn't enough. She sure likes her sweets. Ironic, isn't it? Still, a small soda is better than nothing. Wait, something's off about this soda. It's no drink, it's a gummy. And it's cola flavored too. Of course, she's not the only gummy fan. Just look at this giant gummy worm. Well, let's make like a giant early bird and start eating. From both ends. Careful, you're getting it everywhere. Well, we shouldn't waste it. Melt it. And pour it into a gummy worm mold. We can even make multicolored ones. But they're not doing you any good in there. Let's eat. We've got a garden's worth. Now that's a lot of lollipops. Let's remove the sticks. Add more candy. Pour on some soda. And get stirring. Soon, You'll have a giant lollipop. Not the usual shape, but it gets the job done. Think we can try it on a smaller scale? Well, place it in a bag. And start smashing. Okay, now that should be enough. Collect in a spoon. And melt away. Now you can make even tinier lollipops. All you need are some tiny, tiny sticks. <laughs> and look, there's one for each knuckle. Oh, Nutella huh? chips, sweet and salty. Uh -huh. Some good things really do come in small packages. Can you beat that? Get Nutella. Always a good start. And make some triple decker sandwich cookies. But we're just getting started. Add syrup and candy. Now it's time to trim a little off the top. Wow. 
Looks like our little elf friend here is clearly up to something. Oh, all those poor gummy bears. And candies and sprinkles. But they didn't melt in vain. Now we've got a giant gummy bear. Mmm, cheese. The perennial favorite of cartoon mice. And it's great in so many ways. Whole, grated, and mm -hmm. rainbow colored, apparently. Wow, they even remembered indigo. Now that's what I call fancy. This is gonna be one happy grilled cheese. Mm -hmm. Despite this, I still wow. think he's pretty happy. An apple. Oh, seems simple enough. Now that's more like it. Let's cut it up into cool shapes. Guess the first step to cutting them up is cutting them up. And it can even help you make quick kebabs. It's like a bouquet. And it looks like someone could use it. Personally, I don't care what shape chocolate is, as long as it's chocolate. But still, let's watch. Who knew that chocolate came in so many colors? How cute. Perfect for Valentine's Day. I think she likes it. Looks like it's time to boil some eggs. Scratch that. Make that break some eggs. You know, I always felt that egg whites needed some color. All that work separating the eggs, and they're just back together again. It's the taste of egg with the fun of cookie dough. Eh, jokes aside, Yay. eggs are actually good for your eyes. Wow. Uh. Guess we're having dinner and a show. Uh -huh. Are you sure you should leave that stick on? Yeah. Unless we're cooking balloons. I don't even know what to think. By the looks of it, I guess it was a water balloon. Now to dig into that shell. Mmm, purple. With a hint of stick. I told you we were getting dinner in a show. Huh, after all that eating, it's time for a snack. Ah yes, instant noodles. <sighs> hey, that's not our usual seasoning, or our usual noodles. I think I know this elf's favorite color, all seven of them. Wow. What? Literally taking food out of someone's mouth? Hey, that's just mean. <laughs> An iron. <laughs> Hope this means more grilled cheese. Wouldn't be too keen on unicorns after well, one stole my ramen. <laughs> Guess this elf's a bigger person than me. It's almost too good to eat. Just kidding, I'll have the horn. An oh. Easter elf? I told Santa to offer a dental plan. Oh, so that's where the Easter bunny gets his eggs. This sure
pours quicker than those vinegar dyes. You just knew this was coming. Wow! Oh! <gasps> True! Oops! Wow! A diamond! But still no <gasps> chocolate? Quick! Someone get this elf some jelly beans! An emoji pancake pan! Seems pretty self-explanatory. I'd be more surprised if these weren't different colors. Looks like they're done. Let's see some smiling faces. That purple one looks like he knows something. Ooh. Mm. Now he's a crescent moon. Oh, oh no, oh. the bag! Hmm. How are we gonna get food now? Clearly I know little of elves and their banana summoning powers. Guess there's more than one way to skin a banana. There's gotta be an eating things with a face joke in here somewhere. With a fruit platter like this, who needs a zoo? Oh, Nutella. Great on toast, or just mm. by itself. Mm -hmm. And the food lover's best friend, the spoon. Wait, don't eat the spoon! What are we gonna use to eat soup with? Oh, we're just making spoon-shaped uh -huh. baked goods. Well. Guess it's okay to eat. We can always make some more. Oh. Ugh. Wow. A spiral knife. Can't wait to see this in action. A cucumber. Always good to have some veggies with your gadgets. Graters, they're not just for cheese. It's a great thing we're not wasting the cucumber shell. Wow, it's a vegan sushi roll. Probably could have saved a few bucks using prop food. But that would kind of defeat showing off the gadgets, right? It's amazing stuff. Catch you next time. Is there such a thing as too much candy? <laughs> nah. While you're here, don't miss our bonus episode at the end. Something tells me to open this box. Oh, it's all sticky. Wait a minute. The lock is chocolate. Oh, we can just eat it. Look at all these snacks. Let's just hope she didn't fill up on that lock. Vroom, vroom. We're making a candy delivery. Wow, and this machine grabs candy for you. Just fill it up, close the lid, and pick the candy you want. Want a bite? Good thing these aren't jawbreakers. It's so small, your pets could play with it. Hey, pick your own. A baby doll? Well, it's fun, but I was expecting candy. And there it is. Wow, a chocolate bath. Spas must charge extra for that. Of course, you can't forget the toppings. Oh good, we're not eating the baby. We've got marshmallows. Looks like we're not done dipping lollipops either. Mm -hmm. 
Ooh, a banana. Yeah, something healthy before we eat more candy. So cute! A wow. giant gummy bear! Ooh, he's one tough cookie. A gummy. Eh, what if? I think a little heat should soften him up. Nice and liquid. Now take a stick or two and wrap it up. It's like a giant gummy drumstick. Wow, this robot holds your lollipop for you. But more importantly, it holds it for you when you want to put it down. Always enjoy candy with a friend. Or two. <laughs> Jelly bean soccer. Finally, we need more candy-themed sports. And it looks like we've already got our coach for the big game. Now, we can't start this game without jelly beans. Pour them in. We're ready for the big kickoff. Now, coach, come on, collect your prize. Ow. Oh, no. Quick, put that tooth in milk. Is this soccer or hockey? <gasps> A rose. Oh, how romantic. No, don't eat it. You just pair flowers with candy. Luckily, we already have plenty of candy, too. We just need to melt them down and mix it up. Told you you're supposed to pair flowers with candy. <gasps> Just remember, you're still not supposed to eat the rose. We need to do something about those not-so-pearly whites. There's something off about this toothpaste. Guess you don't exactly need the brush. Good thing, too. You can dig into all these different flavors. Wow, they just won't stop trying to reinvent the lollipop. Are you sure that's the part that goes in your mouth? You don't want to miss out on all that delicious syrup. And the toppings. <laughs> this girl loves her toppings. If this thing dispenses candy, you're always a winner. You need a match to win. But it's not like it asks for quarters or anything. We're gonna make it rain! Candy, that is. Phew. It still looks good. Just wipe off the hair. I know sushi's raw, but that fish looks a little too fresh. Can't forget our soy sauce and wasabi. Though they're probably a little sweeter than usual. Either that, or she really likes things spicy. There's probably a market for candy sushi on conveyor belts. Ah, soda. A tried and true classic. Wait, uh, what are you doing? I get that she needed the bottle, but I could have used some soda. Wow, a nice chocolate cone. Let's add some nuts. <laughs> hey, do you want some ice cream with all that whipped cream? <laughs> oh, 
Of course, anything as delicious as whipped cream is plenty. All these treats, it's so hard to choose what's next. This one's a little hard to figure out. But at least it tastes all right. It's like it's coming out of its brain. Oh, so that's why they call it that. So much candy, so many delicious flavors. B -b -b bonus episode. Time to strut your stuff. Not exactly making an entrance, is she? Quick, get out the cold cream. We're gonna need it. Better yet, duct tape. Hmm. The answer to all life's problems. It takes it off and helps her put it back on. Not like before, but at least it makes an impression. With these wings, she'll be a real social butterfly. <laughs> oh, this tinsel's giving her some ideas. With these clips, they're brand new highlights. As if all that purple hair wasn't already making a statement. And just like that, she's the new life of the party. Remind me to schedule her dentist appointment. Sweet stuff! Catch you next time. Ugh. <laughs> The people in this house need to wash their hands. What happened? Clean up on aisle 12, and 13, and 14. Oh, thank goodness, it's all just chocolate. So at least this mess smells nice. Oh, yummy, gummy worms. Oh, is the brown part cola flavored? And speaking of soda. Mm, I just love green soda. And look at how quickly everything dissolves. Whoa, is that a solid slinky? Ooh. Isn't everything just gonna spill out? Oh, never mind. Now it's just one big gummy. Good thing it's so big. There should be enough for both of them to enjoy. Oh, I guess not. Well, we could just make another. And this time with orange soda. Which is both the color and the flavor. Just keep stirring and... Oh, hold on. Well, the best things in life come on a stick after all. Oh, now she wants to share. Shouldn't they be wearing cat ears? Hmm... I like lollipops as much as anyone, but you've seen where it's been, right? Oh, it's just filled with even more delicious candy. Don't you think more things should come with candy? Oh, someone wants something. Hmm, looks like a cookie and chocolate pudding. Well, let's hope for her sake, appearances aren't deceiving. Ugh. Well, it passes the taste test. What's next? Oh, look. Now she's eating the toilet seat. And now for the rest of the toilet. Probably shouldn't have eaten all that chocolate Ooh. beforehand. Let this be a lesson. Be careful when eating toilets. <laughs> ah, ramen. The best thing that's happened to soup since chicken met noodle. And she didn't even need to add water or anything. Someone sure likes ramen. This girl must really be into those mukbang videos.
Okay, now she's just showing off with those drumsticks. Quick, take the bowl while she's down. Wow. Mmm, pizza. Go ahead and add your favorite toppings, but it can backfire. And an emphasis on the fire. Luckily, ice cream soothes all of life's pains. And it can also come with all sorts of toppings. Great idea! Let's combine both ideas. Pizza, but with sweet foods. And sweet toppings. Who needs cheese when you can use chocolate shavings? Not to mention strawberry sauce. Yeah, why eat Ooh. candy when you can just add it to a candy pizza? And then eat it. Remember, guys, if you eat this much candy, probably a good idea to brush your teeth afterwards. It's always best to eat fruit. Just make sure it's actually fruit beforehand. The scented kind is just trouble. Just like those markers, which you shouldn't eat either. Well, at least you get a prize inside. Another reason not to chow down. And there's something special inside this watermelon, too. See? It's not just cereal boxes that have surprises. Let's hope whatever's inside is something we can eat. Well, it's a balloon. Any food inside? Not even close. Should we cut this thing open or just order a pizza? <laughs> Wow, that's a lot of food. I'd almost say it was too much, if such a thing were possible. <laughs> Another thing that's great with toppings, cake. Uh, looks like you've got all the great food groups. Meat, vegetables, chips, candy. And when you run out of room, just stick things to the sides. Probably remove that lollipop stick before eating. And the candy, you can break a tooth, you know. Ah, the final touch. Whipped cream. And whatever that red stuff is. Don't forget the cherry. No. I guess we're not gonna cut the cake. Ugh. After all, why mess up perfectly clean knives? Mmm, look at all that jelly. Is it liquid? A solid? A marvel of science? And deliciousness? Oh, just look at that jiggle. Almost too beautiful to eat. Doesn't this remind you of that popsicle toy? Hey, how'd that phone get inside? It's taking a while, but on the plus side, at least we get to try out all these gadgets. That's it, this is taking too long. Put your hands in it and get that phone. And it's a fake. The jelly might be good, though. A big mess, but probably edible. Maybe we'll have more luck with the other jelly. Oh, look, a candy bar. Please don't tell me that candy bar is another fake, too. Money? Hey, I wanted candy. Wait. We can use money to buy candy. A lot of candy! Oh. Whatever we're making, things are starting to look pretty sus. <laughs> At least she seems happy with her circle. Looks like we're making pancakes. Come on, just pretend you're writing the letter O. Or a very short zero. Yeah! Should have listened to SpongeBob. Draw ahead first and erase the details. Mm. Oh. She seems to be doing better. Of course, she's got to be artsy with that hair. Sure, there's a hole in the outline, but if I were an art teacher, I'd give her a B. Okay, B minus. 
Of course, <laughs> the real test should be in the taste. Too bad she's eating sour grapes. B -b -b bonus. This must be one of those chickens the Easter Bunny hires as a freelancer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's fun when Easter eggs come with a prize, but seriously, bring out the chocolate. Let's just hook it up to the machine. Should be nice and safe, which isn't easy for eggs. So far, this all seems like a very delicate procedure. Maybe a little too delicate. Anyone else want to just open the bag and eat the chocolate as is? Oh, does it need to spend time in the fridge? Let's hope that duck brought a blanket. Oh, look, there's some leftovers. In lieu of a spoon, I get to lick that cover thingy. Cool. We've got a basket worth of these chocolate <laughs> eggs. Let's see what's in this one. Only one? Oh. Well, at least it fits. That was definitely yummy-rific. Yeah, I made up that word. Catch you next time. Time once again for a friendly toy exchange. Hey, I said friendly. Spray on cheese. Wow. <laughs> Wouldn't exactly call that a toy. Wow, did you know it could do that? Hey, what's with that look in her eyes? You know, you should probably ask before you put your mouth on something. What's this now? An egg opener? I never would have guessed eggs were so hard to break. Eh, don't worry, folks. That chick is just here to watch the show. Well, it said it would open them, and it opened them. You know, if the chick seems to like it, who am I to question it? Watermelon. Oh, healthy and delicious, but doesn't make a mess. If only cutting it up didn't have to be such a chore. Hint, hint. Wow, a watermelon slicer cutter. Isn't that kind of the same thing? Either way, it slices, or cuts, as advertised. Really getting your money's worth. Aw, cute. It's already in bite-sized pieces. I can finally toss that melon ball. I was kind of hoping she was paying attention during our little presentation. Eh, let's just be happy she's eating more produce. What's next? Oh, here's a device for strawberries. But what makes them so special? Let's see what else it can do. Aha, uh -huh, you can use it on a tomato too. Or a slice of pineapple. But why stop at food? Let's try it out on other things, like this little toy ball. Ha, <laughs> good idea. Just look at it come to pieces. So basically, it cuts anything soft and malleable. <laughs> That's good to know. Uh, what a cute little frog. I think I will name him Kermit. And he's got a little pig friend, too. How oddly appropriate. And together, they can suck up all those egg yolks. And look cute while doing it, I might add. Now, nothing can stop you from making meringue cookies. In other words, I want you to make some meringue cookies. If not for me, then for the pig. Aw, give us a kiss. What more treasures does the magic pot hold? A lemon squeezer. Well, it fits right on the lemon. So far, so good. Wow, it turns the lemon into a spritz bottle. You can really perk up that salmon and side salad. Or just do that. And this is why lemon juice is rarely the main event. Oh no, she's already gone mad with power! Will it work? Well, if she doesn't mind holding that big melon, why not? A cucumber sharpener. Wow. These kitchen gadgets are getting really specific. Well, first things first, let's try it out. If you ever need to shave a cucumber, your prayers have been answered. I wonder if it works on pickles, too. Okay, maybe we shouldn't let this girl stay in the kitchen unsupervised. What's next on the menu? 
Oh, how cute. It's a bunny. Ah, it's an egg mold. This should come in handy for Easter. Oh, look, a skull. Must be for Halloween. Or maybe she just likes skulls. Either way, let's see it in action. First, pour out the whites. How cute. The eye sockets are for the yolks. Let's steam it up. The bunny? Uh, we must have skipped a few scenes. Yeah, kind of defeats the purpose of a stencil not to stay in the lines. But to be fair, skulls aren't really supposed to Eww. have eyes anyway. Still, let's wish everyone a happy Groundhog Day. Or whatever this is for. What's up next? A finger knife. Huh, beats sharpening your nails. Technically, your thumb isn't a finger, but why split hairs? <gasps> yeah, be careful around sharp objects. Let's see it in action. Make sure to practice, and soon you'll work your way up to being Wolverine. Schnick, schnick. Yeah, I read that he's just a whiz in the kitchen. At least, when it comes to cutting. Of course, some people just don't have the patience to, well, use utensils. But they sometimes learn the hard way. It's not such a bad idea. Beware. I know girls who say the same thing about their acrylics. Well, whatever this next device is for, it's certainly alliterative. Oh, forget wordplay. Anything involving potatoes is A-OK -okay in my book. I mean, what other root vegetable can you make into chips and fries? Uh, aside from taro, that is. Dude, it's a baby tornado potato. Kind of looks like spiral pasta. Try to see if you can stretch it out. Three, two, one. Ha, even better. You get two potato spirals for the price of one. What else can we try this on? Oh, wow, a spiral carrot. Isn't that just adorable? And look, it's actually kind of bouncy. Up next, the cucumber. Best known for turning into pickles. Wow, she managed to make it a spiral while keeping the skin on. It's that trick where you cut a banana with a toothpick all over again. And just like the carrot, it's a little bit stretchy too. Okay, I think she's starting to get mad with power. Maybe we should move on. Yeah, good idea. What's next? Look, an orange peeler. Guess we're back to those items with really specific uses. Normally, I wouldn't want anything that peels stuff on my finger, but that seems to be par for the course here. Let's see if it works. Oh yeah, great success. The part of the peel comes clean off. In other words, it's time for Clementines to step up their game. See, wow. it even opens up like a flower. Such a beautiful, what the? I was wondering what happened to her. Well, I guess that's another way to open up your orange. Still, I think people want a sense of style with their fruit. It's time for our next item. What's this now? A slicer? You're telling me that's the best name their marketing team could come up with? I mean, it's short and simple. I'm not complaining, but still. Well, either way, at least it seems to be working. That's good. Wow, tomatoes, radishes, and does it even work on strawberries? Yes, it does! I guess a tool like this really speaks for itself. Cool, are we making kebabs, but bite-sized? Well, this looks kind of cute. Oh, it's another slicing device. Let's try it. Kind of looks like a comb, but don't put it in your hair. Put it in your onion. It's clever, but you kind of want a device that does the slicing for you. That said, she doesn't seem to mind. Actually, she seems to be getting a little too into all that slicing. Either this girl just got a catering job, or she's using up all our veggies. Oh well, at least we have another excuse to eat more vegetables. And when you're done slicing, the device adds a little bit of flair. Slice-tastic tool, right? Catch you next time! You ready for your checkup? Let's look inside. 
Ooh, a mushroom. A banana and a burger. Hold the pickles. Now let's give you a few power-ups. Wow. Looks like that mushroom's wearing off. What a cute little toilet! Perfect thing to mix up our chocolate. Careful, it's starting to leak. I'm gonna call the plumber. Eh, never mind. After all, it's just chocolate. Plenty where that came from. Vroom, vroom. Don't get jealous, just get crafty. All you need's a bottle, a stick, cool. and paint. Actually, uh -huh. we're gonna quadruple all that. <laughs> wow. Now add two wheels on the sides. <sighs> it's a snail. Add a leash and take it for a walk. Who knew snails could be so fast? Come on, big breaths. Blow that bubble. Hmm. Okay, we need to rethink this. Ooh, a bubble helicopter. This has potential. Up, up and away. And look at all those bubbles. Quick, try to catch it. You know, if you love something, let it go. It might just come back. Look, this little piggy's got a balloon. Let's help him blow it up. Let's go. Wow, this little piggy's got a need for speed. Our balloon delivery service is going great. Uh huh. Ooh, cherry! Wait, no! Oh, we lose more good lollipops this way. Well, at least it made a new friend. It's a slingshot. Let's take it for a spin. Hey, just be careful where you aim that thing. Good thing she's wearing glasses. <laughs> huh? Wow. Look, you can even throw them by hand. <laughs> ah, watermelon sure hit the spot. How'd that get in there? <laughs> eh, we needed some nanotape anyway. It's the perfect container for all our slime. You know, all you need are some seeds. And it's a watermelon slice. Can't eat it, but who cares? It's squishy. Watch out! Oh, poor little burger squishy. You know what'll perk you up? A makeover. Complete with a nice new coat of paint. A few touches, and it's a frog. Aww. How about a kiss for luck? <laughs> so when does it turn into a prince? <laughs> what a great looking house. Wow. Oh, the big one ain't too bad either. Aww. Now add some melted white chocolate. Let's try that again. This time, aim for the house. Can't forget sprinkles. It's like glitter, but for food. Okay, now you can take a bite. Ooh, I'd wash those hands if I were you. Nature provides. Take one egg mold, crack an egg inside, and add liquid soap. Close it up and give it a good shake. You've got egg-shaped soap. Get scrubbing. Probably should use some water, too. Ah, nice and clean. Wow, 
Dolly here's got some great shoes. And they're even better with pink sauce. Chef Dolly can even help you stir. Add some cheese and voila! Bon appetit! A spoon and chopsticks. What can't she do? Wow, so that's where candy hearts come from. But if hearts aren't really your style, add some heat and melt them up. Now we can whip them into shape. No bones about it. Let it cool. And it's a skeleton! Some assembly required. I hope he tastes as good as he dances. Soda break! Huh, you're thirsty too? Well, you do look parched. I know. Add the bottle to a paper cup. Ooh, a mosquito! The original vampire! But this one works in reverse. It gives out drinks. Now you can share your drink. Careful, this stuff goes right through him. Well, angsty poetry won't write itself. Gesundheit. Ooh, is that gelatin? Oh, and it's still fresh! Let's collect some with a food injector. And squeeze it out into some nanotape. Oh, it's getting nice and round. Let's give it a little face while we're at it. Now don't squeeze too hard. Or is that the idea? This skull's seen better days. We need a fidget break. Let's combine business and pleasure and use this toy to spruce up our skull. Perfect thing to make some eyeballs. A little small, but they'll do for now. Hmm. While we're at it, why not a whole new face? Pucker up. Now for the hair. I know a horseman who'll just love you. <laughs> Wake up! The spiders got loose again! Wait, that's no cobweb. It's cotton candy! Add some inside this bell. Add glitter. And more cotton candy. Take it out. Oh, it's a cute little ghost. But now it's melting, melting, oh! Ooh, blue soda. Have a sip. Mmm, apples. But she's not going to eat it. It's going to be the perfect teeth mold. Mm -hmm. Fill it up with melted candy sticks. Let it dry and peel off your new teeth. Just the right size for our little round friend here. Pretty candles. But look at that wax. Wait, that's no wax. Ew. It's dough. Looks like it's baking time. Twist it up and add some heat. for some snake-shaped bread. Slide it down into some sauce. And 
Enjoy. Time for milk and cookies. Oh no! Why must the delicious die young? Hmm. Wait, maybe we can fix it. Add jelly. And some marshmallows in a row. Now it's a sandwich cookie. Just one with a little more bite. I got a little something. Oh no! Our chocolate! It'd be a shame to let it go to waste. Draw any shape you like over ice. A choco spider! But it's too cute to eat. This'll really liven up the room. No, don't bite your nails. Here's an idea. Pour a milkshake into some plastic glove fingers. Plop a bone or stick or whatever inside. Freeze it up, and you've got a new ice cream treat. And look at that manicure! Finally, a milkshake you can eat. Time for a mirror check. Now that's a breakout! It's okay. Just melt that candy. Add some special ingredients. But this is no ordinary cover-up. When it cools, it's a candy treat. Just needs a little whipped cream. And maybe a little more spider. Oops. Take a hot dog and add some dried pasta on top. Now give it some eyes, a mouth, and our special secret ingredient, love. Now cook it up in boiling water. All that hair should be nice and soft. And, more importantly, ready to braid. These dogs are looking good. But I think they could use a trim. Mmm, toast. Oh, I hope you Ew. like it well done. Yeah. Let's try again with a kitty cookie cutter. Now give it the full body treatment. With a candy six pack and marshmallow pecs. Nothing wrong with a little tanning session. Now add a face and a cute button nose. Add a bow on top and it's Hello Kitty! It's time for a quick crunch. And enjoy your sandwich s'more. Ooh, hot chocolate! Eh, it needs a little something. Pour some melted chocolate into a mold. Swirl it around to get a nice shape. Pop it out. And fill with marshmallows. Make a few scratches on the side. And give it a familiar face. It's Grimace! Let's give him a nice hot cocoa bath. You know, for somebody named Grimace, he sure puts a smile on your face. Wow, this cake is just so pretty! It's gonna be our new phone case! Now let's add something on top. 
melts some gummy candies into shape. Before it hardens, add a stick. Now pop it out. You can squeeze it and lick it, but don't forget the wrapper. So good, you'll eat the whole can. Told ya. Take some dough, add food coloring, and roll it up. Once it's green, flatten it up. Make some holes to give it a face. Let's whip up a whole batch. Now add to some oil and fry it up. And they taste great with milk. Just eat it before it's mush. That's the Ursa Major of Gummy Bears! Let's look inside. Wow, it's a whole bunch of gummy bears! Let's line them up on wax paper. And turn on the heat. Once it melts, why don't we add some noodles? Fold it up into place. And maybe add some sugar. Now give it a good stretch. Poor Jay! He's melting! Oh, what a world! It's okay. We can make more treats. Let's stay on the theme with a letter mold. And start by giving it a face. Now pour on some liquid gelatin. Let it congeal and pop it out. Now let's give it a good lick. Nice bowl, but it's not for fish. It's for melting cotton candy. How else can we see what's inside? Ooh, that makes two vowels. But cotton candy can do much more. In fact, we can use it to make letters. Complete with a face on top. But when it comes to these letters, I don't think we need an eraser. First, let's give F a much-needed facial. And free our food friends from the freezer. Ooh, they don't look so good. Now that's what I call a banana split. Don't worry, we never leave a banana behind. Ah, much better. Though, bread's still looking a little blue. Nothing beats a snack with a little shake. It looks like a certain shark agrees. I think you're gonna need a new snack. Ooh, I think this snack's a little too fresh. Let's make a new one. Cut some soles out of a big biscuit. Cover them up with fondant and cut them into place. Now let's add some color. Add 10 little piggies on top. And here's a treat that won't get ticklish. Okay, who's up for making sand ducks? Wait a minute, there's a tiny duck inside. It could be our new model. We're making marshmallow ducks. Let's add a face. 
and some powdered sugar. A lot. They're just the thing for our special hot chocolate. You know what can be a lot of fun? Cat food! Especially if we whip it into shape. Ooh, looks like a takeout order. Talk about 15 minutes or less. Or would you prefer fast food? And there's enough to go around. Great shoes. Can we borrow them? In fact, it's got such a nice look. Maybe our cupcake should try it. Just don't forget the number one rule. Shoes always come in pairs. Mmm, nothing beats fresh bread. If only that were fresh bread. Well, if it lasted this long, let's help it last forever. Now add some wires inside. Dim all the lights and turn on the bread. Wow, they really don't like paw prints around here. Congratulations, it's a Pokeball. Right this way, now take a seat. I choose you, Pikachu. Aw. This kitty knows how to beat the Monday blues. Let's see a movie. He did pay for the tickets. I've heard of cats and hats and puss and boots, but pants? Pants? Huh, I gotta see this. Try not to sit down. Hey, it worked. I wonder if this works for snacks, too. Ah, busted. And to think he stopped shaving for this? But maybe, instead of hiding food in your beard, you hide your food as your beard. Remember, it'll work better if it matches the hair on top. Ah, whipped cream. Looks like shaving cream, but far more delicious. <laughs> Try belting out some ho ho ho's for good measure. Of course, you just can't top sneaking in with a fall guy. Works every time. Maybe sharing with the bouncer will sweeten him up. Well, that wasn't very nice. Don't worry, cheese puffs. With a little elbow grease, you're a fetching new chain. It just needs a little something. Good idea. Candy string. Just keep them safe under your cap. And give yourself some new highlights. Or better yet, give yourself a whole new do. <laughs> wow! Almost time to start clubbing. But first... Hmm? It worked! Hmm? Go right on in. <laughs> now for a little victory nibble. Spit it out. Guess you Ew. did bring enough for the whole class. We need to think outside the box for this one. Ooh, take a cupcake and crumble it up. For that perfect soil look, we'll need some worms. But to keep them edible, let's make them cola-flavored. These straws really help give them a nice, wormy texture. Throw on some fake plants for good measure. Huh? It worked. Let's just hope this isn't botany class. 
Anyone in the mood for a 4th of July ice pop? Who says chocolate can't give you a six pack? And she didn't even do a single sit up. I think we've earned some confiscated candy. Uh, sort of. And we've got the perfect place to hide them. These new glutes go great with your abs. Time to pump iron and stay out of the sun. This case can do more than just hold ear pods. Pour on some melted chocolate and let it harden. Make like it's your birthday and start blowing. Talk about making a chocolate shake. Now we've got chocolate headphones. Guess our lollipop mm -hmm. didn't pass inspection. Just as planned, the teacher's none the wiser. <laughs> hey, how'd yeah. you get in here? This isn't the place to have M&Ms on hand. Huh. Add the brown ones to a cage. Now add a pet inside. You know, it's kind of a good thing food's not allowed in here. Otherwise, that librarian would be tossing cookies right about now. It looks like you need a little more height to enter. And your little cola isn't too welcome either. It's time to start stepping. No, really, we're making platform shoes. That should take care of both your problems. Step right in. Careful, this guy's on the case. He's investigating from the ground up. Oh no! Just think of all that poor, wasted candy. Quick, sneak in while the guard's distracted. Well, that's one way to cut up a watermelon. Hurry, eat it all before anyone sees it. <laughs> Here's an idea. Wear some big tape rolls like bracelets. Hide some candy underneath, as much as you can. Now cover it up with cotton, like a cast. And why stop at just the arm? If anyone asks, it's been a bad week for her. But things are about to get a lot sweeter. What a great performance! If she knew there's no candy in jail, she'd never have jaywalked. Luckily, someone brought her a toy car in a cake. Everyone's always getting their snacks delivered these days. Good thing we've got a cat on the outside, too. Now let's put those strong teeth to good use. And carve yourself a skeleton key. Good thing you filled up on candy. Don't worry, our friendly neighborhood janitor's here to help. And if you want something to wash it down with, don't worry, he's got you covered. Strange, it's not your birthday. Eh, let's open it anyway. Looks like we still need to cut the wrapper. Wow, they really go all out for the gender reveal parties. And these silicone bellies sure are getting popular. Never pay those museum cafe prices again. Now, what's going on here? Mm -hmm. Told you shop was more fun than band class. Mm -hmm. Especially when you can hide all sorts of snacks. Just take one wafer, grind it up into shavings. Why don't you try a handful? Also works with coconut. 
probably should get back to woodworking. Eh, who needs furniture when you've got chocolate mushrooms? She doesn't look too happy. Is gum really a food? After all, you don't really eat it. Of course, you don't normally wear it either. But that's not gonna stop her now, is it? Let's add some candy buttons. Get it? Wow, she really likes your perfume. Mm -hmm. We're in! Why not take a nibble? Sneaky-ceptional stuff. Catch you next time. To quote the great Shrek, better old than in. Something fishy about this toilet paper. Ah, it's food. What about this shampoo? One way to find out. Although I guess you could have just cut into it too. Come on, don't mess with us. Can the toilet really be cake? Hey, save a slice for the rest of us. Careful, we need to separate the yolks from the whites. Now we'll never make that meringue. But maybe this little spider can help. Crack an egg on top. The yolk stays put while the whites slide down. A food serving train? Good. I always like a meal when I travel. Don't forget the caboose. Mmm. With condiments like this, who needs food? Wow. Okay, maybe a little food wouldn't hurt. <laughs> Which dip will it be? Why not all three? Clearly, uh -huh. this girl has an exquisite palate. Uh-oh, Pauline's having one of her perils again. Hurry, quick, or there's gonna be ketchup flying everywhere. Oh good, the train stopped. Kinda forgot they could do that. Some nice tea will be soothing. You know, some people use just one bag at a time. Don't worry, Mr. Penguin here's got you covered. Just hang the tea bag around his beak. Turn the dial and he'll lower it right into your cup. Let it spin around and it'll lift it up just in time. Now you can enjoy your drink. Next, let's try out a little experiment and give these cookies a full body dunk. Now for a nice big spoonful of, uh-oh. It's time to think outside the spoon. An ice cream scoop. Dunk inside ice cream or some ice cream-like substance. Wow! Press the lever and it all comes out. You can't go wrong with a cone and sprinkles. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's add more scoops, every color of the rainbow. Wow! Well, it's good, but next time, let's reach the ceiling. Okay, we need tiny cuts. And by the looks of it, we'll be at this all day. There's just gotta be an easier way. Try this. Wow, these scissors are like an optical illusion. Make multiple cuts at once. What a time saver. And it works on peppers, sausages, all sorts of things. Now we're ready for breakfast. Don't forget the herbs after all that. You'd think she'd learned her lesson about tea. 
Finally, a drink that requires a toothpick. Once again, our bird friends will come to the rescue. Just place tea leaves inside this flamingo. Place in a cup and add hot water. Just look at it transform the water into tea! Refreshing. And there's no need to floss. If you're a tea lover, why not collect the whole zoo? You know what goes great with cereal? Bugs! Eh, just kidding, they're not real bugs, they're bag clips. Close the bag and save the rest for later. Look at that, a ramen noodle notepad! Write a note and peel away. And add an extra level of security to your food. Of course, the bugs will probably help with that, too. Let's mix things up and start with the device. A donut mold. So, naturally, let's make some donuts. Save the holes. We can make munchkins. Now fry them up and let them cool. Can't forget the frosting. We've got something special, Nutella. Drizzle it on. You know what's next, sprinkles. <laughs> and what a bouquet. Mm. Ooh, what's in the box? Diamond ice cubes? And this little funnel will help keep us precise. <laughs> we just need to plop it in the freezer. Yeah. Now we'll have some diamonds for our treasure chest. <laughs> <laughs> All this pirate's gonna get is sticky hands. Oh, slaving over a hot stove sure keeps you sweating. Guess we don't need that in-home sauna after all. Oh. Headphones? Wait, no. It's a neck fan. Hmm. A fan for your neck. Pretty self-explanatory, really. And it's great if you want that windblown look. Selfie time. Ever get the feeling we're forgetting something? Yum, a watermelon. That's one way to slice it up. Here's another way, a fruit slicer. Look, you get to take it apart. And you can always use the right tool for the job. There's even a little melon baller. What a work of art, almost too good to eat. Now there's gotta be an easier way to squeeze fruit. A lemon squeezer? Okay, let's try it out. Place the lemon inside. Remove the plug and give it a good squeeze. Just add sugar and water and we've got lemonade. Hey, we don't do free samples. Food terrific stuff. Catch you next time. Careful now, don't wake Granny. Ooh, what does this button do? Oh no, her hard candies. Looks like we woke the other one too. In Granny's day, they didn't have fancy board games. Look, she'll show you how to make your own fun. It's the Opila bird in cardboard form. And it looks like it's feeding time. Just leave some candy for the rest of us. Wow. Chopsticks? Oh, glow stick chopsticks! Enjoy your favorite noodles. 
or just go to a nice dance party. Either way, seems like a great time. Of course, Grandma prefers to eat with a friend. This doll may be dressed for the occasion. But she's not just the guest of honor. No, she's going to be our new utensils. Make like ballet class and do a little twist. Mmm, still could use a little more salt. Wow, now that's what I call a gummy worm. Ladies, please, there's plenty to go around. In fact, why don't we slice it all up? Now they're gummy buttons. Just the thing to sink your teeth into. But Nana's got her own recipe. To make a whole colony of worms. Crunch up some cookies for a little dirt pudding. Now it's time to start cleaning your plate. Mmm, tomato juice. But you should really aim for the cup. Maybe this drink dispenser should help. Just pour and it goes right into the cups. Ooh, this would be great for guests. But if you don't have this cool tool, don't worry. Just poke holes in a paper cup. And add a juice or soda bottle inside. Oh, great idea. Add some straws. Twist the top and the fountain's running. Probably should keep some cups handy. Where do you get all these tiny glasses anyway? I've heard of lady fingers, but not like this. Wait a minute. Those are some sneaky sausages. And this will cut it up into bite-sized pieces. You think Grandma will want some? No, she's got her own idea. Add metal wires to the end of a baster. And run the hot dog through. Wow, they're like French fried frankfurters. Try saying that five times fast. Hmm? Don't worry, our peanut butter machine isn't really scary. Unless, of course, you're a peanut. So, do you prefer chunky or smooth? He told you he wouldn't bite. Well, I meant to. Granny, on the other hand, is a different story. And what big teeth you have, Grandma! All the better to open this melted chocolate. Use it to draw anything you want over ice. Oh, a spider web! Just the thing for some spooky cupcakes. An egg mold? Well, let's get cracking. Now dunk in some boiling water. Good thing we've had some cooking. Just look at all the shapes you can make. But Nana has her own method. Take some foil and bend it into a shape. You can even separate the yolks. Ooh. I've got my eye on this egg. Talk about a seafood diet. Granny prefers food with a face. Hmm. 
Uh-oh. Who knew there was such a thing as too much syrup? Try this dispenser. You can make a bunch of jelly flowers. Perfect thing for dipping cookies. When you run out of milk. Now it's Granny's turn. She's got her 3D pen. Yeah, this grandma's a real tech whiz. What's that she's drawing? Whoa, a skull! Starting to see where Wednesday here got her spookiness. Mmm, fries! And it's great for dipping, too. What a cute pig. Let's feed it seeds. Must be a blowhole situation. Ooh, the swine shells the sunflower seeds. Now try saying hmm. that one five times fast. Ooh, messy. It's okay. All you need is a plastic bag. It's like a bib you hang on your ears. Chew on those seeds and spit them out. I wonder if this works with watermelon. Well, when life gives you lemons, you know the rest. Let's start squeezing. Have we collected enough juice? Wow. Yeah, she likes her lemon juice nice and tart. Grandma prefers to use the tops of old bottles. But either way, orange juice straight from the source. Extra pulp, just the way Nana likes it. Why don't you try? Well, I guess Grandma knows best. Wow, some people really get into spring cleaning. Makes sense. Look at all that free slime. Uh-oh. Oh, so now you want to eat your greens. Here's an idea. Take some chia seeds. Mix them together with water into a paste. Of course, a little sugar won't hurt either. Some food coloring, too. Huh, I see the girl likes green. Now you can have your slime and eat it, too. And there's plenty to go around. Oh no! Your banana! Now how will you get your daily potassium? Wait, don't eat it. Here's something that should help. This is no ordinary sheep. It's a banana peeler. Place a fresh banana chunk inside and crank that tail. Look, it's got a fresh new coat. And it's delicious. Ooh, you uh, got a little something in your teeth. It's okay, we've got toothpicks. Ooh, whoops. Okay, who let that porcupine back in? Huh, there's gotta be something to help sort these out. Aha, this little birdie's a toothpick dispenser. Open it up and add all these toothpicks. The bird picks it up for you one by one. Now let's get you picture day ready. Wow. You know, it also helps to chew your food. Now who's gonna pick all these sticks up? Mmm, time for a little candy break. This girl's way too into 52 pickup. At least you caught some. Uh-oh. I think I found that chocolate bar. Try not to get it on the couch. Don't worry. 
We can make a new treat. Once you add your toppings of choice, pour on the rest of that melted chocolate. Almost done. We just need to freeze it. Okie dokie, now it's a delicious Choco Dino. I wonder if he tastes like chicken. I'm told they're kind of like cousins. Who's ready for some poached eggs? Well, keep waiting. Hey, another helpful animal friend, a turtle. Crack some eggs in and throw out the shells. Now give them a soak in a nice bath. Make that a jacuzzi. Looking good, but they'll look even better on toast. Now Mama Turtle's got some other eggs to get back to. Oh, delicious cookies and milk. Now make like a basketball and dunk. Uh-oh, you're stuck. Well, no use crying over... Mm, never mind. Maybe this giraffe could help. Just place a cookie inside and dip. Works for milk. Icing. And sprinkles, too. But don't forget the real fun, eating it. No, cake isn't usually crunchy. This should take care of those shells. Put the egg in the egg opener. Open the box, and it's cracked open! The shells stay right in the box. If only the rest of the eggs stayed put. Mmm, cookies fresh out of the oven. And ready for a little decorating. But if we want them looking their best, we're gonna need a little help. Place a stencil on the frame and close it up. Add icing on top and smooth it out. When you're done, lift it off and the design stays on. Let's hope they taste as good as they look. Mmm, delicious! Save me a blue one, will ya? And a special thanks for all our kitchen animal friends. For a second, I thought I was in a cartoon. Kitchen-tastic stuff. Catch you next time. Okay, let's see. Purple stuff. Ooh, milk. Mmm, it's like drinking straight from the cow. Of course, if you want to keep it authentic, you're going to need an udder. Or at least a glove. Quick! Don't want you crying over spilled milk! This hot dog's getting all the worse! Mm, almost. Careful! Save some for the sausage! Let's clean you up and give you a helping... nose? Oh, it's a dispenser! Fill it with ketchup. Seal it up nice and tight. Give it a good squeeze. Finally, this hot dog's waited long enough. Now take a bite. Who wants some nice juicy pineapple? You'll notice I didn't say fresh. Be careful where you throw that thing. Told you not to pick from the bottom. Here, Mama has just what you need. Mm. A cute little car that also opens cans. It's all revved up, 
Let's take it for a spin. Would you look at that? The one time you're supposed to drive in a circle. Oh, that bread is just within reach. Well, at least we've got them down. Try this bag clip. Sure, it might be rude, but it sure helps put things together. How about we try it on an actual bag? Now let's get back to that bread. Fast food is sometimes food. And this is not one of those times. But we can still whip up a burger. A nice apple bun with a kiwi patty. And some apple fries on the side. Take a bite. It should be juicy. Ooh, crepes. Let's fry it up. Huh, doesn't look too good. I know. Some googly eyes will perk things up. And look, you can make him talk. But if you really want to have breakfast fun, Try this dinosaur-shaped waffle maker. Just add batter into each dino shape. You know, a little food coloring can make a big difference. It's ready. Let's start with the triceratops. Oh, dino-licious! Someone passed the syrup. A growing girl needs her milk and dairy. How else could she use this ice cream roll pan? We'll need some chocolate shavings. Candies. Now it's about time we get things rolling. And get chopping while we're at it, too. Can't forget the chocolate sauce. And enjoy. Careful, it's cold. Mmm, rice. Oh, I told you to practice. Wait a second, I think something's inside. This'll help us make some adorable rice balls. Let's start with a cute cat-like shape. Next, we need to add some toppings. Like some dried seaweed. This gives our cat some eyes and ears. Try one! No utensils required. Can't make an omelet without breaking some eggs. I like it a little crunchy, but not like this. Try this instead. It's an egg mold. Just crack an egg inside and no shells. Close the lid and add to boiling water. Give it time to turn opaque. Not to mention cute. <laughs> and more importantly, delicious. Okay, the burger needs a stunt double. Ah, uh, we're gonna need some nasal spray. Good thing your wig broke your fall. Wait, what? Culinary tacular stuff. Catch you next time. Well, would you look at that? Grandma laid an egg. Wow.
Well, it sure beats paying those store prices. What? Oh, I think someone's at the door. Who is it? Hmm. Well, whoever it was, they left their backpack. What? Let's take it inside. Hmm. Meanwhile, we also gotta separate these eggs. Mm, gesundheit. Oh, it looks like Mr. Backpack can help. Hey. A yolk separator. <laughs> yes. Try it out. Just crack an egg on top. Now it's time to get things running. Oh. Pour out those yolks. We're making meringues. Mmm, corn. Time to sink your teeth in. Oh, I didn't mean it like that. Well, it's okay. Make like a banana and peel that corn. I wonder what else it can peel. Give it a good squeeze. Oh no! Your glasses! And you can't see a thing without your glasses! When did that pigeon get in here? Oh, wait. That's no bird. It's a gravy boat. But it's not just for gravy. Add that lemon. We've got juice. Now perk up that tea. Mmm, good to the last drop. Huh, maybe we should have started with donut holes. Or maybe we just need the right tool. Good thing we still got all this batter. Give it a push, and the donuts just plop out. Flip them over once they're golden brown. They're ready. Once it cools, take a bite. Of course, we can't forget about <laughs> topics, especially sprinkles. This carrot needs some tenderizing. Or better yet, mashing. Add some inside. And squeeze until it comes out like Play-Doh. Try this on all your favorite veggies. But the real fun comes next. Getting to eat. Careful, stay inside the bowl. The bowl! Okay, that whisk isn't cutting it. Or whisking it. This sauce stirs great for a hands-off experience. Just make sure to keep an eye on it. Nah. Now you've got a date with some sauce. Meanwhile, let's catch up on some knitting. It's time to grate some cheese. Careful. Little more. Huh, barely made a dent in those hot dogs. Oh my god. Don't worry. We can always try a little hand guard. Now you can grate anything you want. Granted, not everything needs to be grated. Gummy worms should be eaten al dente. Mm, noodles. And we've got oodles. You know, it's even more fun to eat it. Uh -oh. What a tangled web she weaves. This looks like a job for our T-Rex chopsticks. It's a utensil that works on both ends. Great for those hard to reach bites. Huh, first Jack Horner in that pie, now this. If you're gonna stick your thumb in food, you're gonna need some help. It's slicing with a hands-on approach. Yeah. 
and it'll let you tackle the whole produce aisle. Now everyone will want to peel potatoes. Who needs a green thumb when we've got orange? Aww. Just don't forget to eat the food when you're done. Wow, I never saw cookie dough leak before. It's not a hair dryer, it's a cookie press. Add whatever cookie cutter design you like. Just press. And pretty soon, we've got cookies. Look, it can be as easy as stamping. And I think we've got some left over, too. Ah, bread and butter. So wow. simple, and yet so good. No wonder Madeline eats it every day. If only the butter could actually spread. Luckily, butter lipstick runs smooth. Well, that'll wet your whistle. But let's save some for the toast. Get into every nook and cranny. Nah. Now let's try some English muffins. Ooh, and a bagel. <laughs> Time to drain the pasta. Oh, whoops. Oh, uh, so Ew. who wants pizza? Come on. Oh, wait. Hey. Maybe this pasta strainer can help. Just add to the side and pour. The pasta's safe and sound. And I've got a great sauce recipe. Ooh, Grandma's mastered the whisk. Yeah. Just in time for her special cookie recipe. Of course, right now it's in more of a pancake stage. But that's nothing <laughs> our cookie stamp press can't fix. And look at all the different stamps. Now into the oven they go. Why not take a bite? Ah, cookies. So good, you can't stop at just one. Some food's mouth-watering. Onions aim for the eyes. <laughs> wow, that's pungent. Good thing she's in the shower. Apparently, it's okay. Rubber Ducky's got your back. A new pair of glasses is all you needed. Wow. They'll protect your eyes from watering. So get shopping. It is tea time. Oh, that's too hot. Let's try something cool. Take this silicone mold and fill it up with tea bags. Aww. Now, if we want to make ice, we're going to need some water. Wow. Gotta love any excuse to use a funnel. Now stick it in the freezer and give it time. Okay, that should be enough time. Let's take these tea spheres out for a spin. Yay! No, not like that. Add it to the water for a brand new twist on iced tea. This'll go great with some green tea ice cream. Grandma marvelous stuff. Catch you next time. Mmm, wow. delicious lunch. Huh? Uh. What the? This burger is a lie! Well, at least it's squishy. 
And so is this donut. Personally, I prefer cheese pizza, but this is still fun. I'm starting to think that's not chocolate ice cream. Okay, let's separate the yolks. Hmm, Ew. looks like we're gonna need some special help. Hey! An egg separator. Just what we needed. Seriously. What you waiting for? Crack an egg! Now let's pour out the whites. Kinda runny, isn't it? Don't forget about all those yolks either. Hmm. Looks like Oops. you're a little runny too. You've started a trend. <laughs> Who's ready to make banana pudding? Not too hard now. Then again, potassium's good for your skin. Next time, let's just use our little sheep friend. After all, he's a banana presser. Add the fruit. And it's all ready in a few shakes of a lamb's tail. Ooh, it kind of looks like string cheese. Either way, tell that sheep it's shaving time. Sorry, he doesn't eat breakfast. More for us. And it's the perfect chance to use our garlic mincer. Hmm. Forget bite-sized. This goes right to the taste bud. Scoop it out. It's all good to the last drop. Nah. Oh no, he's back and he's still hungry. That's nah. one way to get someone to cut your food for you. Oh, so many nuts. And here we are without a nutcracker. Or even a sugar plum fairy. Wait, I still think we should get one. Oh, thank you, Mr. Ceiling. It may not look like it, but it's our brand new nutcracker. Let's try it out. Push down, and it works. I'd say you've earned yourself a treat. Oh, first a vampire, now a g g ghost. Quick, someone needs to call Scooby-Doo. What? No, it's just our new gadget, an auto mixer. Swirl these colors around and around. Now this crepe is a work of art. Who wants salad? Let's start by cutting up this cucumber. Okay, we're gonna need some help. And here it is! Ooh, it's a quick slicer! My favorite speed! Add a veggie and the chips start flying. Looks good, but it isn't just for veggies. It's raining cats and dogs, but without the cats. Good morning, you could use a coffee. Well, good thing it's laundry day. Just add some water and powder in our tiny washing machine. Press the button, close the lid, and drain away. Well, this should help perk you up. And look, it even does laundry too. Just what exactly are you feeding our chickens? Guess it's time to get cracking. Or better yet, let's try out our new eggshell opener. We just need to take a little off the top. Look what's inside. Candy! A unicorn! Unicorn candy! Hey, careful, don't forget about gravity. Yeah. 
That s'more sure is fun, but I'd prefer something edible. Hey. But why choose? Hmm. We've got a marshmallow melter. So let's make s'mores. Add a cracker, chocolate, marshmallow, and another cracker. Why not make two? Seal it in nice and tight, cause it's time to bring on the heat. Oh, just look at those marshmallows. Give it time to cool and enjoy. Oh wow, for a second I thought she needed a manicure. Hey, what's that? Ooh, a wiener slicer. Just add the wiener and twist it around. Keep going and soon you'll have a sausage with a spiral cut. Now they're the perfect thing for our breakfast smile. Oh, she's on toast. So simple, so fragile. Maybe this sandwich cutter will help us. Add some cheese, shred it this time. Let's add some color. How about all of them? Now it's time to get cutting. I guess someone really doesn't like crusts. We're just getting started. Let's press it. And when life gives you cheese, grill it. Yay! No matter what color it is, cheese is always best gooey. <laughs> Hard-boiled eggs are delicious, but peeling them is a different story. Nah. Unless, of course, you've got hey. an egg peeler. Which we do. Good for us. So convenient. Just give the egg a good shake. And look, the peel comes right off. Just like that, it's all ready for dinner. You're supposed to boil the eggs before you crack them, but not anymore. Take an egg and crack it into the mold. Look, there are shapes on the bottom. Put those molds in a strainer. Add a lid on top. All that's left is to add some steam. Let it cook and the eggs are practically hard boiled. Just without all those pesky shells to peel. Look at all those shapes. Look, it's a bunny! Something tells me we should follow these paw prints. Oh, buried treasure! We're gonna need a shovel. Spoon. A shovel spoon! Let's dig. What do you think we're gonna find? Oh, look at all these different jewels. They're so colorful and shiny. Uh, this one looks different. Ooh, it's a golden coin. How much is it? It's like a wooden nickel, but without the splinters. Hot dog. Wow. It's a hot dog toaster. Wow. Told you that hot dog tree would pay for itself. Just plop those sausages inside. And look, it'll help toast the buns for you too. Mmm, nice and toasty. Just bring it together and add some ketchup. Or maybe mustard, relish, hmm. cheese. Ooh, hot sauce. <laughs> Remember, aim for your mouth. Wait, the cooked eggs are for the other skit. Food panda stuff. Catch you next time. Uh-oh, you're breaking yeah. out. Was it something you ate? <laughs> cool. A pimple cake? 
Well, at least you're ready for the occasion. Squeeze away. Yeah, get it out of your system. Wow! We've got a donor for our next treat. Just need a little gel from Mr. Jelly Bear. Add the gel inside bubble wrap air pockets. The whole Jelly Bear family must have come out to help. Of course, filled or not, bubbles are for popping. After all, how else are we going to taste it? Where do you think all this candy leads to? That flamingo needs new hobbies. Meanwhile, let's taste the rainbow. Throw in some popcorn kernels and start cooking. Can't choose between popcorn and candy? Choose both! Scoop it up and enjoy. Anyone up for a movie? This truck has something better than horsepower. Oreo! A lot of people like to go right for the cream. So, why not add some more? And more toppings, too. Stack up more cookies. It's cartoon sandwich rules. Cover it up in frosting, like an itty-bitty cake. Of course, if we're making a cake, it should really look the part. <laughs> Our cake's also going to need a candle. Happy birthday, little guy. Silly. Puppet toys aren't clothes. Not really food, either. But we can still use it to make our new snack. Fill each button with melted chocolate. <laughs> now take some pretzel cool. sticks and break them up. Plop a stick in each button before it hardens. Pop them out. And mushroom pickings never looked easier. Don't worry, they're safe Ooh. to eat. Looks like Red's ready for Halloween. These marshmallows are in a spooky mood, too. Let's help them get their costumes ready. Dip some pretzels into melted white chocolate. Stack some up on a skewer. And it's now a skeleton. Remember, it's always nice to share. Round and round it goes. And when it stops, no one knows. As tempting as it is to play with your food. Nothing tops plopping a jelly strawberry into your mouth. Or giving it a nice big bite. Let's add some sauce for an extra special taste. Frizzle it on if you're feeling extra fancy. These gummy worms want to help with our next treat. Time to hit the sauna. Turn up the heat. Anyone else expecting gummy waffles? So long and thin. They're the perfect nesting material. Perfect for hiding from gummy chickens in plain sight. Red's so good, the apple's already cut. And we'll need our fruit mouse-sized for this treat. Ah, fruit. Nature's candy. Now pour on some soda. We're making ice cubes. Well, ice spheres, actually. Collect some in a glass. All this snack making's thirsty work. So, let's add more soda to our drink concoction. Wow! What a cute teddy bear! With a surprise inside! Now it's time to heat up the skillet, cause we're making pancakes! With a dispenser like this, we can make any shape we want.
We've got enough teddy bears for one of those picnics. Of course, most people don't eat pancakes dry. Ah, candy. Can't beat a true and tried classic. Or can you? Add a bunch to this jelly. And we've got a whole new twist to corn on the cob. Why is corn always getting stuck in your teeth? Hey, Red, you think you need a wet nap? Real shame we had to cut that musical number. Please tell me you washed your hands before we started shooting. Always best to chew your food. Remember, the most important ingredient is love. So, who wants takeout? Pretty sweet stuff. Catch you next time. Nana also wants to make sure you're fed, too. Though this oatmeal could sure use some toppings. Mmm, banana slices are a good start. Also great for ice cream. Got any ice cream? Well, either way, this is perfect for a bite-sized treat. Of course, Grandma has her own way of doing it. Just twist up an old fork, and it slices just like that. Always nice to go for a stroll in the crisp fall air. Uh-oh, looks like someone needs to go on the go. Luckily, she came prepared. It's a tent. This should give her some privacy, but hurry. Let's hope she remembered TP and hand sanitizer. Grandma is fine with a sheet and some clothespins. Anna is nothing if not frugal. Huh, well, this could probably tide her over till lunch. Do you need antacid? Oh, never mind, it's just a melon. Let's slice it up. And we've got the perfect gadget. Grandma's really into those Bond movies. And just like Bond, she's got her own special gadgets. A blade, a pipe, and gravity does the work for you. Whatever happened to good to the last drop? Don't worry, your grandkids here to help. Just slice up the fruit. Add to a juicer. And enjoy that freshly squeezed taste. Hey, aren't you gonna share with grandma? Well, she's got a few tricks up her sleeve. All you need is a syringe. Fill it up with strawberries and start pressing. Uh, sure you don't want a cup? Either of you? Our chef here is making dumplings. Wrap it up. Eh, just don't squeeze out the filling. Maybe we should just order a pizza? Oh, good idea. This dumpling maker should help. Doesn't push too hard, and they come out looking great. Grandma has her own secret dumpling trick. Fold it up and use a fork to give it texture. But her secret recipe for filling stays a secret. Oh no! A bug! And right on her skirt, too! It's okay. She came prepared. A bug catcher. 
Just press the button, and away it goes! Uh-oh. Almost forgot some bugs can fly! Calm down. Nana's got a secret weapon. A matchbox! The perfect trap! Just slide that bugaboo inside. Mmm, sushi! Don't worry, she brought her own chopsticks. Though they're the kind made for beginners. Think training wheels, but for utensils. Besides, Grandma has her own tricks. Cloth napkins. Roll it up, and the chopsticks are attached at the hip. Of course, nothing beats just practicing. Rhinestones. They're not just for costume jewelry. They can give your face a little sparkle and shine. Just try not to immediately scratch it all off. Here's an idea. Cut a sponge into a shape. Add makeup, and it's a cute little stamp. Just don't go nuts or it'll look like chicken pox. Speaking of which, she should really get that itch checked out. Now, now, Nana knows best. You need your five a day. Meet her halfway. Eat your greens, but have fun. Add a cuke to this device and start carving. It's a spiral. Almost like eating pasta. And there's no shame in washing it down. But if you wanted spirals, all you had to do was ask. Make some cuts to an old soda can. Twist your cucumber on top. And you get spirals. With a nice hint of cola. Of course, cukes aren't just for eating. Spa day! Naughty puppy! We don't eat your kibble! Guess she'll have to get a new snack. This kebab maker should help. Add meat. Lots and lots of meat. Just the way she likes it. Grandma has other ideas. No wonder she drinks so much soda. Fill the bottle with meat. Add a stick. And squeeze. Ah, looking good. Just don't forget to cook it up. Mmm. Now, pass the ketchup. Wow. <laughs> huh? Hungry again? Of course, there's always room for sushi. This should help. First, add the rice. Now, some sashimi. Like this salmon. Maybe some greens, like avocado slices. Close it up and squeeze out on some seaweed. I don't think it was supposed to come out like that. Luckily, we've got a master chef in our corner. Just place the ingredients in an ice cube tray. Why not fill the whole tray? Add the rice last. Flip it over, and voila! You've got sushi! So he said, but then she said... Oh, wait, hold on. So when's your next dentist appointment? Hmm, maybe some whitening strips could help. Just place on top of your teeth. Give it some time and peel away. Already looking much better. Does Nana want to try it out? Nah, she's got her own trick. Activated charcoal. 
Just chew it like gum and rinse. Gotta have some tricks with all the tea she drinks. Maybe she's a natural. Or maybe she went to hair and makeup. Still, nothing wrong with trying a new look. Roll it around and let the bubbles do the work. On second thought, let's just call the salon. Better yet, I think the wig store takes coupons. Nana and her magic soda cans to the rescue. Just cut out a little square. Add hair inside. And blow dry those new curls into place. Wow! Amazing! Does she do highlights too? <laughs> Looks like someone got up from the wrong side of the bed. Maybe you should go back to bed. This gua sha tool should help with tension. Wow! Wait, how did it fix her hair? Anyway... Grandmas want to look their best, too. These spoons should help smooth things over. Ah, spoons. Helping you look your best. And they're great for soup. Grandma-azing stuff! Catch you next time. You know, they do make great presses nowadays. Well, at least this way we can say you put your foot in it. Yeah. Now add gummy worms to the juice and stir until you can't stir no more. Uh -huh. Look at that. Uh. The stick doubles as a lollipop what? stick. Take a bite. Mm -hmm. Time for a fun day down at the farm. Sort of. This little piggy can help us separate our eggs. And look adorable while doing it, too. Ah. How about we make a trade with our friendly neighborhood vampire? Mm -hmm. You know, garlic is really powerful stuff. It gives you the power to separate eggs right at your fingertips. Mmm, an apple. What? How about we give it a nice peel first? And we have the perfect machine to do just that. Just give it a twirl, and the skin's practically gone. Judging by all these apples, I guess it's kind of addicting. Still, we shouldn't let all these delicious peels go to waste. Hmm. Now let's see, what can we do with these potatoes? But who needs a special machine when you've got power tools? Just stick the tater on the drill, keep the peeler close, and go. That was quick. Who wants french fries? You could eat your hot dog all at once, but where's the fun in that? This wiener dog will help you get bite-sized pieces. Puppy approved. Aww. Not that we needed a second opinion. Hey, what's wrong? Oh, it's stuck between your teeth? Some floss should fix that. Hmm. It's great at cutting up hot dogs, too. In every direction. Just use the unscented kind. Floss or string can make cooking them a little easier. Best of all, you can use it to make a necklace and always have snack close by. This miscellaneous tree sure is handy. Do you think it's got something to help us cut onions? Oh, look, it does! Seems simple enough. Put a chunk underneath and chop away. You can just pour it in your pan. But I guess we've got a lingering aroma. Huh? Wow. That's it. We'll cover your face with a pan lid. Just secure with your hood. And <laughs> chop away. Careful with that knife. 
There's no such thing as too many potatoes. Think of all the chips. Add ketchup for flavor, a potato, and grind away. Do you think we can make corn into corn puffs? Careful now, vermicelli's a terrible thing to waste. Here's an idea, tie them up to fry them up. Don't forget to season for flavor. Oh, this is a crime against dumplings. Try this mold. Place the dough and filling on top and press down. Just plop into a pot of boiling water to cook. Now for the taste test. Got your sauce ready? Hmm, this glass could be useful in another way. Add little balls of meat to the dough and fold up. The glass will let you cut little circles out. And the only question left, should you boil or fry? Wow, these commercials are great! Uh, uh-oh, you ate all the popcorn. Well, we can fix that with this popcorn maker. Wow! Time to pour in some kernels and watch the show. We've got enough popcorn for a matinee. Always wanted a popcorn bucket that doubles as a bathtub. Oh look, there's a prize inside! Skittles! Let's add to a skillet. Pour on some more kernels. With a little bit of oil, it's time to get ready for some rainbow popcorn. Let's scoop them up. What's this new device? Uh -huh. A burger maker. Just spray the bottom and add the bun. Plus onions, cheese, the patty, and close up. Spray this part and we can crack an egg on top. Cover it up with a bun. Add just a little more spritz. Remove this disc and it all falls into place. Still, there's no harm using tongs. Mm -hmm. Who would have guessed that chicken and eggs go so well together? Ew. Did you know that cucumbers help with bloating? <gasps> and a potassium-rich tomato will make a perfect substitute bun. We can even keep the onions and chicken patties. A handy-dandy toothpick will keep things in place. Personally, I'd flip it over and eat it like a candied apple. Okay, let's see what we got here. Milk, flour, eggs, sugar, and what's this? A pancake machine? <gasps> Just pour the ingredients. It even helps you measure. And it gives you a hand with blending everything together. Now for an easy release. These hotcakes sure look good. Stack them up. All we need now is the syrup. Uh-oh, we're out. The syrup seems so close, yet so far away. No, don't lick it. We've got a better idea. If we can't bring the syrup to the pancake, We'll bring the pancake to the syrup, so to speak. Mix in the bottle for chocolate pancakes. Of course, if you want to put chocolate syrup on chocolate pancakes, nobody's stopping you. Let me guess, they cook them in the shell for flavor? Don't worry, this device will make peeling a day at the beach.
But maybe this fork can do more than bringing food to your mouth. Just hook under the shell and peel away. Now you're ready for any seafood buffet. Mmm, buttered toast is so simple, yet so delicious. If only putting the butter on the toast wasn't so hard. Wow! Now it doesn't have to be. This device makes spreading butter as smooth as lipstick. You know, speaking of lipstick... Let's try the original! What? Just clean it out and use it to scoop up some butter. Add a cover for some safekeeping. Now you can always have butter on the go. It helps to bring your own toast, too. Buttered toast is just too good to only eat at home. Yeah, watermelon! Let's slice it up! Oh, and we have a device. Hannah thought she was gonna do the whole thing by hand. Oh, it's a skewer. Let's use a bunch to turn this melon into a hedgehog. Cut in between and you've got some slices on a stick. Kitchen sational stuff. Catch you next time. Aw, looks like Grandma's got a visitor. Wow, that's a lot of food. Wait, did you see any German brothers and sisters on the way here? Mm, maybe she's just a sweet old grandma. But seriously, either way, don't go near the oven. Time for Grandma vs. Gadget's showdowns. Stay tuned for the bonus episode, too. Separating the yolks from the whites. <laughs> Kinda makes you wish they were just sold separately. Oh! Looks like a cross between Birdo and Babe. But it sure does get the job done. It's almost clean off. Huh, I wouldn't think to pair eggs with something that looks wow. like a pig. Well, maybe with a side of bacon, or ham, or sausage. Nothing like a relaxing night watching a movie together. Uh-oh, they're out of popcorn. Don't worry, we've got you covered. Cue the next gadget. Just pour in the kernels and push the button. You can already hear everything popping. Just keep that cover on or the whole room's gonna get covered in popcorn. Oh, it's still spilling. Good idea. Add it to this giant bucket of... Oh, wait a minute. I guess you can never have too much popcorn. After all, you don't want to run out again. Mmm, potatoes. So delicious, but so hard to peel. Hmm, she had an idea. And I don't think it's just to make rice instead. It's a new gadget. You get a peeled potato and a really long potential french fry. But why stop at potatoes? Let's see what else this baby can peel. Remember, you peel it, you eat it. Aw, oh, some fruit should be nice after all that junk food she gave you. In other words, Granny's on a health kick. And we gotta be sneaky about our sweets. Let's just hope that this device can help us. Wow, it gives you a hollowed out banana. Still, let's not let all that good banana go to waste. But now for what we came for, using our banana's secret hiding place. Cue the Nutella. 
I've heard of chocolate-covered bananas before, <laughs> but not banana-covered chocolate. Come on, like you can really keep a secret from Granny? It's tea time. Some herbal tea can be a really good choice. Look at those leaves. Ew, a tea leaf. Oh, it looks like she's got something up her sleeves. A pink elephant? Oh, I see. It holds the leaves for you. So this way, all you get is just the nice, smooth tea. And it comes in so many different flavors. From squirrel to manatee. Collect them all. Poor Nana. All those birthdays and no one's gotten her an electric mixer? Don't worry. You don't always need something electric to make things easier. Just watch. We can even mix the ingredients inside this giant bottle. Don't get any eggshells inside. And shake it. Shake it like a Polaroid picture. Really getting our money's worth out of these cookie cutters. Ooh. Mmm. There, Grandma approved. Microwaves make cooking easier, but they're such a pain to clean. Hey! Angry Mama? Are you sure? We might need Angry Grandma, or even Great Grandma level. Don't let anyone know that's not her real hair, or she'll get really angry. Don't let the mess intimidate you. She looks like a fighter. What? Did you think she'd just do the whole thing for you? She just made it a little easier. Time for cake. It's no one's birthday, but <laughs> Grandma knows you don't need an excuse for cake. Don't worry, they even have a gadget to help you serve cake. Seriously, there's something for everything. Look at how tightly it hugs the piece of cake. And don't forget the best part. You get to lick the device at the end. I knew I should have called dibs. Time for another snack. Ooh. Some fresh, healthy cherries. Oh. oh no, a lost tooth. I knew we should have stuck to cake and ice cream. Either way, we've come prepared. A handy dandy cherry pitter. Granny seems impressed. Guess she has to watch out for her dentures. B -b -b bonus episode. Uh -huh. When you can't decide between a ball pit or a pool, why not both? What a cute little whatever it is. What's she gonna do with it? Ooh, it's like a tiny little doorknob. But something tells me it won't be tiny for long. Told ya. But what are we gonna do with it? Throwing them on the wall? Kind of reminds me of that carnival game. Except the balloons are the darts. Wait a minute. So that's how you make that toy from before. I was wondering how they were connected. And now you can make a whole team of them. Grandsational stuff. Catch you next time.
She's under the weather. Some cough syrup can help. If only it tasted better. Ew. A mini water dispenser? Well, it's important to stay hydrated. Oh, I see. We're filling it up with the cough syrup. I guess what she doesn't know won't hurt her. The opposite, in fact. Just don't ask for seconds. <coughs> oh no, the whole house is gonna get sick. <coughs> it's time for someone to get their checkup. Three guesses which tooth needs help. Uh -huh. oh, what a mess. We're gonna need to rebuild this one. Better, but all these teeth could use some metal work. Braces just seem to add a little shine to your teeth. Cool toy, hmm. but we could afford a real dentist at this price. Uh, I don't think this place accepts coupons. Ah, softener. Everyone's favorite Christmas present. And with a little imagination, we can make a giant mouth. Complete with all this junk to clean out. If only she got this excited cleaning her own teeth. <laughs> Mr. Banana, watch out! Oh, this is not his lucky day. But don't worry, we'll fix you up good as new. Let's just remove some of this goop. And you're in luck. We've got the perfect donor. Just need to cut it down to size. And our handy stapler will help keep you all in one piece. Wow, let's put you on display. Silly puppy, here, have a bone. We've got something planned for this rubber chicken. Lie down and we'll get you all cleaned up. Congratulations! You're gonna be a mommy! And it'll be their birthday in three, two, one! Aw, look at the little duckies. Wait, duckies? Maybe they just take after their father. We've got a Huey, Dewey, and a Louie. Let's patch you up for some family fun. Oh, look, they're making nest angels. Wow, a uh, bell pepper cyclops. Granted, that's one more eye than most peppers have. Which makes cleaning it all the more important. Hey, stay still. We're just going to add some drops. Hmm. And you probably need this eye patch. Good thing, too. He's always wanted to be a pirate. She's ready for her dermatology checkup. Remember, pimple squeezing's best left to professionals. Much better. Now let's squeeze in a haircut while we're at it. Yeah, this doc wears many hats. Also went to beauty school. Time for extensions. Wow. And I'm not talking about your scalp. Ew. But what's a makeover without a new dress? Now it's time to take on the world. <laughs> Freddy always needs to look his best. <laughs> But makeup isn't something you borrow. I mean, you can't exactly give it back. There should be plenty of toys in here. It's that potato chip bag all over again. But just look at that fluffy tail. And you can make it wag. 
Let's cover it up before he catches a cold. And look, it's a phone, too! Yay! After some tail wagging fun, we should watch some videos. Hey. Oh, look, it's a polka dotted unicorn! Oh, guess she just needed a bath. Still, nothing <laughs> wrong with a new look. Huh? And we've got stickers to share. Hmm. Here's an idea. Airbrush some color on. And when it dries, peel them off. Oh, it's a crab with a need for speed. Let's go. No, uh, the other way. Uh, the other way. Plants up ahead. Turn on your blinkers. And look, he can go sideways. Mm, sort of. Aw, he even brought you snacks. And then some. This crab really takes care of his friends. Ooh, blocks! All oh, right, the magic box. Something's moving. Ooh, unicorns. Who's up for a pony ride? Yay! Come on, girls. Let's go racing. Ooh, this one's got a chariot. Okay, girls, it's nap time. Even unicorns need their beauty rest. Oh, we've got lots of poppet toys! Wow! I didn't know they could light up. Who knew crabs could be so fun? Uh oh, I think it belongs to someone. Well, someone sure is acting crabby. Hmm. Ew. Don't worry. Every good doctor knows their ABCs. Writing's a different story. Let's check inside. Remember, don't eat things that aren't food. Well, at least cake's edible. Also, happy birthday. Here. This should help perk you up. And that's how you turn a B into a P. Oh no! It's an alphabet crime scene! Ew. It looks like foul play with a capital F. Either way, these letters need our help. To the alphabet hospital. Let's start with A. Hmm. Let's see. Enlarged belly, water breaking, and ah yes, small letters inside you. Looks like A's going to be a mommy. Okay, you might feel a slight pinch. Happy birthday! Oh, having twins! Make that triplets. Congratulations. Aw, let's clean you up. Ew. <laughs> and that's where lowercase letters come from. Uh-oh, <laughs> looks like C's got cavities. Good thing you minored in dentistry. Now we just need some replacement teeth. Always good to put yourself Ew. in your work. Ugh. Wow, C's got some serious canines. <laughs> oh, poor R. At least I Ew. think that's R. Let's fix up your eye. Your retina's wrecked. Much better. Yeah. Now for that leg. Hmm. This tube will pop it back into place. 
and a medical walking boot for the final touch. Poor P, you're practically in pieces. Don't worry, we'll patch you up. And for being such a pleasant patient, you've earned yourself a sticker. Pizza, the ultimate P word. Yeah. Now let's finally foil that fiend. F, you need to face the facts. But maybe we can fix you up. Ooh, it's hot. Thank you, nurse. So that's what's causing you to act out. A candy heart for extra kindness. Now everyone's finally friends once more. Quick, give him some air. Not you. Air! It's okay. Earth's the original food doctor. Let's remove this worm while we're here. Almost done. Just gotta patch you up. Just remember, the best medicine is love. He laid an egg. Didn't know they did that. Oh, careful now. It seems all right. Just clear off all that slime. And see what makes him tick. A rainbow. So that's what unicorns are made of. Look, it's a pop tube and a dinosaur all in one. Let's hope there's no dip it in gypsum you buy it policy. Well, at least it breaks off easily. What else could use a nice dip? No, you need your phone. Well, let's see. Well, now you really need to buy that flamingo. Not that it minds the new neck extension. And I do mean extension. Wow, look at that. Even comes with a green ribbon. Now to find the ultimate toy. Watch out! Ouch! <laughs> wow! Wow, she's really got a head for secrets. Hmm. Cool, a light show in the palm of your hand! Aww. And just wait until you see the ceiling. Kind of hypnotic. Hey, who turned on the lights? Mm. All we need is a cup. Just make some holes in it. Run a marker along the top. And add some light. Just give it a quick spin and you're ready to go nocturnal. Let me guess, she wants one at the bottom? Oh, but it was so worth it! A bubble machine! Start at the bottom and make a bubble tower. How could Dad say no? Still, you should ask. Guess he could say no. Eh, don't worry. Just take a fan and part of a soda bottle. <laughs> Put them together and keep them secure, like with a band. Give it a dip in some bubble solution. And prove quality trumps quantity. See how big you can go. Look hard and you'll find a good deal. Probably. Ooh, a nail kit. 
Let's just hope it's really on sale. Look at all the looks you can give your nail. Well, what are you <laughs> waiting for? Try it out. Each finger's gonna be a work of art. Quick, a distraction! We can make our own nail kit! It's a custom-made stamp. Just add some polish. And you can add flair to more than just your nails. What a weird little store. Oh, it's a pedicure toy. With all these corns and ingrown hairs, it sure needs a pedicure. You know, some aloe would help all that dead skin. A little subbing can work wonders too. Now that it's clean, it's time for some real fun. Dad'll have to let you have it after all that work. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh honey, you already have a foot. Two in fact. And we can put our feet to work. Trace it out. Add paint. Hmm. Ooh, these fake nails will add the perfect touch. It's a little flat, but it's our wow. own homemade pedicure toy. Though I guess the polish is sold separately. There's candy too. Oh, but it's so far away. Luckily, this robot hand might just put things in reach. Yes! Today, the Snickers bar. Tomorrow, the cookie jar. And it'll help you get attention in a pinch. Looks like dear old dad has another idea. And not just because he's already got a hardware store grabber. Cut up some straws and trace your hand. Use the straws and some yarn to give the hand a skeleton. No bones about it. Look at that grip. Wow. And it really comes in handy when your nose itches. <laughs> There's something strange about this place. Still, let's try out this drawing projector. Give a disc to Mr. Giraffe and press the button. Now just choose whatever you'd like to draw. Don't forget the seeds. Hmm, doesn't look too much like the original. Hmm. Why not try this instead? Fill a box with lights. And cover the top with clear wrap and sand. You can draw whatever you imagine, and it's easy to erase. Plus, it makes adding those little touches even easier. Aw, what a sweet message. <laughs> Pots? Cans? Is this a toy store or a cooking store? Let's see if it delivers on the no-spill thing. It works. Good thing, or she'd be a mess. Dad will have to want something so practical. Guess not. But hey, who needs scissors? Besides, we can transform any bowl with suction cups. Let's try it out with solids and liquids. Wow, it can even withstand a leaf blower. And since the cereal survived, it's time to eat. Pretty cool stuff, right? Catch you next time. Careful now. Those chips look like they need a delicate touch. Really? Especially now. Her water just broke. What? Let's make sure your chips aren't soggy. Oh, good. Nice and crispy. Though, I usually mm -hmm. prefer barbecue. 
look. A fun-sized bag of chips. Make that twins. Let's seal you back up for a family reunion. Family time's always better with chips. Hi, <laughs> Mr. Pineapple. Wait, aren't you allergic? Good thing he also went to dental mm -hmm. school. Some braces will help straighten things out. And more importantly, make your mouth shiny. It's time to lay down the wires, and we're done. Yay! Don't worry, this one's on him. Good as new. <laughs> Miss Tomato, you're all uh -oh. red! Let's give you a checkup. Oh, look, your water broke. Someone tell Daddy Tomato. <laughs> ah, so that's where cherry tomatoes come from. Aw, oh, he takes oh, no. after his Uncle Pepper. <laughs> Better days, baby Grogu has seen. Don't worry. First, we'll help clean you up. And then give you a checkup. Oh, we really need to clean out those ears. They say earrings can turn your ears green, but I don't think that's an issue for him. Now let's do something about those nails. <laughs> Should be quick, he's only got six fingers. Let's finish it all with a nice, clean face. Ah, all better. Now strike a pose. This is the way. So, Mr. Pear, it looks like you've got a gummy worm. So slimy, yet so delicious. And that said, let's play it safe and clean the area. We'll need to make an incision. Just remove. Add to syrup to avoid browning. Mmm, chilled fruit. A true summertime treat! And a band-aid should help patch you up. Hmm. <laughs> Ooh, Miss Corn, it looks like you're breaking out. First, let's remove the infected pieces. and transform them into delicious popcorn. Ooh, sparkly. These jewels will make excellent fillings. Oh, Mr. Onion, that smells bringing tears to my eyes. I'm sure a little breath freshener won't hurt. But let's get to the root of the problem. Remember, onions have layers, like ogres. Silly Pikachu, how'd you get in there? We know what Band-Aid you'd like. All better. Or even the best, like no one ever was. Poor Orange. I guess vitamin C can only do so much. Looks like we need to take a closer look. Careful, just a couple of slices. Let's remove all that excess goop. Still, it'd be a shame to let it go to waste. Put those ribs back and close them up. Nothing beats that fresh squeezed feeling. So you say you don't feel like such a hot potato? Nurse, keep the recessa tater close by. Ah. You know, he's really a peeling spud. I mean, he's got me under his skin. 
See, your true beauty's on the inside. We just needed a little exfoliation. This yam's always giving a piece of himself. He's really such a sweet potato. What a transformation! He's a total spud! Ms. Pomelo says she's got a headache? Well, let's take a closer look inside. Huh, I think we'll need to operate. Just need to take a little off the top. Maybe tame that stash, too. Hmm. Don't worry, it's just a little brain surgery. It's not like it's rocket science or anything. We're in. Now it's time to clean house. And maybe replace hmm. that old bubble wrap. Yes! These buttons are fresh from the toy store new. We'll just need to stitch you back up. Good as new! And this baseball cap's on the house. We lose more good rubber chickens this way. Looks like it's time to go, Doc. So, where's my lollipop? Or is this a toy chest sort of situation? Surgical-tastic stuff! Catch you next time! Come on, squeeze! Maybe a little tighter. No, that's too tight! Don't worry, that stuff washes right out. And Dad has the perfect thing to help. Just give it a little push, and he dispenses exactly what you need. Now brush those pearly whites. Be careful with that comb, or it'll be messier than before. Wow, it's like an anime heroine's wand. Is the talking cat included? Just put your hair inside and it styles it for you. She's even got enough hair to make a mustache. Let's see who else we can make pretty. I'd watch your next step if I were you. Trucks, the perfect thing for a nice trip. Aw, oh, don't cry. No, really, it looks like an easy fix. Huh, these corn sticks might just come in handy. Dip in some tea and stick together to make anything you can imagine. It's a brand new truck. And look at all those colors. <gasps> Things can sure get scary yeah. at night. There's the nightlight when you need it. <laughs> Don't worry, a good story will cheer you up. Oh, it looks like it already did the trick. <laughs> Spoke too soon. We just need to fill this rubber glove with uncooked rice. Leave it on her shoulder and it'll feel like you're there. You know chocolate tastes better if you get it inside your mouth. Looks like someone needs a bath. Or at least a facial. Yeah. Luckily, we have something to make bath time fun. Just fill up with shampoo. Now crank that handle. Look at all those bubbles. Ooh. This looks so fun. Maybe we should keep it for ourselves. Now we've got her attention. <laughs> 
Aw, just don't forget to wash that face. And behind the ears while you're at it. This is why it pays to get the furniture insured. Maybe we'll get lucky and she'll run away to join the circus. The solution's right under our noses. This tank top. Because they don't make high chairs for big kids. Though honestly, the whole thing's an untapped market. Time for a quick jog around the house. Or inside, rather. Ouch! Who put that table there? Hurry, she needs a band-aid stat. And maybe some cookies. Oh, don't worry. Dad has just the thing to help. An old tennis ball. Just cut a hole along the side, like this triangle. Scold that naughty table and put the ball on that sharp corner. Always better to be safe than sorry. Somebody stop that paintbrush! We need to back things up a little bit. Okay, okay. What this girl needs is a smock, and this plastic bag works great in a pinch. And it works just like tracing paper. All clean, except those hands. Just imagine if she was finger painting. Oh, french fries. Looks like someone's sneaking snacks. Guess he's one of those do as I say, not as I do parents. Well, maybe we can meet her halfway there. Let's cut up some apple fries. That's some knife. It even removed the stem. Use the old container. Wow, she can't tell the difference. Kind of surprising, but let's just enjoy our secret stash while we can. Something's wrong with this soap. Hey, I thought you liked slime. Foam shaped like a flower? She'll love that. Just look at her shirt. Maybe she loves it a little too much? Well, at least she's clean. Looks like this sink's out of reach. How is she gonna wash those hands? Luckily, this duck can help give you an extension. Also comes in elephant or dolphin. And you can even flip when needed. Always good to let your kid get some fresh air. And even more important, fresh puddles to splash in. With all this splashing, she's all wet. And so is he. These should help. Waterproof galoshes. Kind of makes you wonder why he waited until now to break them out. Especially when he has his own pair. Some artists are their own worst critics. But here's something that can help. A projector. He can shine out pictures of a bunch of animals. So that you can practice how to draw them. Look at her go. Don't forget to color it in. Soon you'll have your own zoo. Cool, refreshing smoothie sure would hit the spot. The expression too many cooks comes to mind. 
Let's hope all that milk cancels out all that spice. Guess not. I haven't seen this much fire breathing since the Ren Fair. A mini blender? I guess this will let her try out her experiments. Without using dear old dad as a guinea pig. At least she's starting healthy with bananas and milk. Uh-huh, I see that she doesn't want any hot sauce. It's fun coming up with flavors and all. Just don't forget to drink, it's the best part. Back to the drawing board, literally. If only her hair wasn't in the way. Looks like a job for these hair stickers. Much better. Who needs markers and paper when your hair can be a work of art? Parent amazing stuff. Catch you next time. Gesundheit! Quick, we need tissue stat. And maybe some hand sanitizer. This little egg will slurp up this mess. And spit it back out, too. And look at that. We can practically color code it. All we need is a yellow one to eat some blue slime. Oh, it's cold. This is why toilet seat warmers are the future. Barring that, these popping bubbles can help. Just cut them out and add a bunch to your toilet seat. After all, we can't all be covered in blue fur. See? That already feels much better. And you've got something to help you pass the time. Ah, the only thing better than chocolate is more chocolate. But don't forget to take care of your teeth. This device can help. Just remember to add toothpaste. Nice and foamy. Open up. That's it. Nice and wide. Keep on brushing. Already looking better. Probably should wait before eating more chocolate. Looks like someone needs to wash their hands. And their ears. This remover is safer than a swab. And it lights up. Good start. But this stuff's really in there. Looks like a two-prong job. Almost scared to ask, but what about the other ear? Oh, that one cleaned up in a jiffy. Now it's time to check. Never even knew he had ears. The first rule of arts and crafts, you need the right equipment. With this device, we don't need to worry about dried up markers. We can keep them wet with our personal liquid supply. It's time to try it out. See, we just need water to make a picture with this set. Look, it's a dinosaur! And it looks like he's brought some friends. Do you think the marker's really necessary? Or can we just add water? Just take an empty cup, fill it up with water, and let it pour. I wouldn't touch that water if I were you. Wow. Even better, just run it under the faucet. Wow, there are a lot of toys in this store. And it looks like she likes to play with them all at once. Maybe she just needs a little distraction. And this suction cup fidget bracelet might do the trick. And if not, at least they'll keep her in place. Oh, I guess I spoke too soon. But at least it looks like she's having fun with them. Back to demolishing the toy store. Never too young to take an interest in nature. 
No, don't eat worms. They're great little fertilizers. Here's a better snack. And the spoon's so easy to attach. Look at that. It squeezes right into the spoon. Make sure to save the spoon when you're finished. It's perfect for when you want a little taste of something. I wouldn't touch that if I were you. Just in time, we'll need to do some baby proofing. With a 3D pen, we can literally draw what we need. You can make a custom cover that fits just right. And it can look however you'd like. Just make sure it fits. Good. This will help her get the message. Be careful! You're getting that blue stuff all over! Just rest your cup on this device and spin away. Everything stays in place. Let's try something bigger. It all stays in place too. Think we can go any bigger than that? Eh, let's leave the fish out of this. Much better, a milkshake. Complete with cherries on top. Around and around it goes. And the cherries are okay. A sale. Okay, how much is that doggy? Well, can't say no to toilet paper. It's kind of important. Just think of all the different things you can do with it. Like this. Draw a line and roll up a skewer. Squeeze up the TP, remove the skewer, and take out a black marker. Draw on the end and add little dots in a row. Make a bunch and pour on some water. It's like they're turning into caterpillars. They're the perfect pet. Don't need to feed them. And you only need to bathe them the one time. We're living in a digital age. Let's add some extra touches. Here's something a little extra special we can draw up. It's a minion! And it's just the right size for this missing key. He can use some company. <laughs> oh, look, it's uh, Kermit the Frog. Why not invite the whole gang? Have a party. Parent-tastic stuff. Catch you next time. W. Wait, why? Oh, why? Also, who? And what? Well, I'm sure we can fix you up. Careful around the eyes, all four of them. Looking good. Let's just stitch you up. Much better. What would we do without W? Well, I guess this brings new meaning to love letters. Poor P. That was positively petty. Look. A beauty box. This should help you go from pauper to princess. Let's not start on an empty stomach. Ooh, is that fudge? Well, whatever it was, it's not helping your complexion. Come on, P. We gotta pop that pimple. Ugh, pus. And look at all those pustules. We need high tech. Like this pimple vacuum cleaner. <laughs> Suck out all that pus without dirtying your hands. <laughs> Chocolate isn't so good for teeth either, even if it is delicious. Oh, don't cry. All you need is a good brush. Ooh, uh -huh. and electric one. 
Can't forget the toothpaste. Oh, I can taste the mint already. <laughs> hey, you don't need to move it. It does the work for you. <laughs> We're almost done. And voila, look at that smile. Are you okay? Uh-oh, it looks like you hurt your bottom. Next time, let's soften the fall with a little cushion. Just put on these push-up panties. Under your pants. You're not Superman. Now shake what your mama didn't give you. And show the other letters who's queen. Oops. See? Told you it would stick the landing. Unless you want to open a candle shop, why don't we ditch all that wax? Here's just what you need. An earwax remover. And you've got plenty of removing to do. I wonder where else this could help. Good idea. A clear nostril will help you breathe easy. Next, it's important to keep your mouth in good shape. I mean, between eating, talking, and kissing, your mouth does a lot. And speaking of eating, you've earned a nice treat. An ice treat. Now wash it all down. Uh, sort of. And there's always room for chips. Always. Uh-oh. Talk about being tight-lipped. Don't worry. All you need is a little pumping up. And that's what our little vacuum pump does best. Much better. Daisy Duck's got nothing on you. That said, what's the fun in having lips without getting to decorate once in a while? And these swabs are the perfect paintbrushes. Break one end and let the color soak in. And let your lips be the perfect canvas. When L's around, there's always lots of love. And a lot of lush, luscious locks under your limbs. Of course, L also means lovely, lickable lollipops. And when it's this sticky, it can take care of all that excess hair. Well, we've got two armpits and two lollipops. Though I guess you could have just used the other side. Now for some rings on your fingers. Huh, maybe we should spruce up those hands first. Let's start with all that dead skin. This looks like a job for some wax. Take fresh wax and cook it up in this wax bath. Always pays off to buy candles in bulk. Soak those hands and let the wax dry. Peel it off and your skin should feel brand new underneath. Now that your hand's so pretty, you might as well put a ring on it. Time for a mirror check. Oh no! Look at those eye bags! Either you need a serious power nap, or we could try this ice mold. Let's cut up some aloe. and add some water inside. For the next mold, let's try glitter. 
Don't forget, every ice pop needs a stick. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> Once it's frozen, apply the frozen aloe oh. under your eyes. Wow, your face is like a clean slate. So now let's try out that glitter ice. But we're only half done. Now for the top half of your eyes. We'll need some pink to match your hair. Uh, maybe we should try using stencils. Or even better, make a shape with tape. Just give your eyes some corners. And slather on that makeup. Take off the tape and you're looking sharp. And your eyes match your glitter. Now let's comb that hair. Uh-oh. Well, it's okay. We don't need that comb anyway. We've got just the tool for this job. Just hook up your hair and run it through. Now it's time to start spinning. And enjoy your brand new do. Your makeover is almost complete. Uh -huh. <laughs> Let's just do something about those overalls. <laughs> How about a whole new outfit? <laughs> and some new accessories. It's time to show the world the new you. <laughs> Starting with the other letters. Uh -huh. <laughs> L looks like he's in love. Sorry, boy, you blew it. But your friend J seems nice. Ah, P and J, they're almost a sandwich. Let it pen to stuff. Catch you next time. Hey, F and N, play nice now and be careful. Oh, no. Oh, oh, poor, oh. Hey, I wouldn't laugh if I were you. Oh, might just have friends in high places. Oops. Uh -oh. Hey, this is a school. <laughs> F's are for quizzes, Ouch. not lockers. Uh, huh? You know, I'm starting to think this locker's bigger on the inside. Oh, wow, and there are some familiar faces here too. <laughs> Why if it isn't D? Aren't you feeling a little crispy today? And if it isn't little Ms. Popular herself, P. Pretty soon, Jay here will feel right at home in Flatland. Let's smooth out V into a U. And maybe something special for K. Well, that was fun. Now it's time to start smashing. Wow, who knew aliens were so stretchy? Why don't we pound them up, just like mochi? Now we've got a batch of new slime to play with. Wow. Oh, don't worry, we can blow them back up too. Hey F, you got any chips to spare? This little dentist sea toy can chew up the food for you. Or maybe he wants a snack. Looks like his eyes are bigger than his mouth. Mm, sort of. Ew. Oh, you've got a little something in your teeth there. That's much better. Let's add some mouthwash. Now it's time for a good brushing. Good boy, see? You've earned yourself a little treat. You could eat that. Or we could try out your new grinder. 
Something tells me that wasn't an orange. What else can we grind up? A sock? Why not? Orange and blue go great together. See? Wait, see? Well, see ya. What more colors do you want? Whatever it used to be, it's spaghetti now. When you're done with that spoon, take a dry erase marker. Draw on your favorite letter and add water. Pretty soon, it's gonna look like alphabet soup. Temp tattoos have never been easier. Oh, look, it's B. He's just in time to play with our new toy. Guess he can cancel that acupuncture appointment. Besides, it's time for your massage anyway. Uh, so that's where you keep your slime. Here's an idea. Let's add some pop-it buttons. Lay them all in a row. Use the toy as a guide. Now start pushing down right into the slime. You know, they don't need to stay in order for too long. <laughs> Looks like F is whipping up some gypsum. Oh, I guess we had a spare poppet toy. T? Feeling okay? You're looking kind of pale. Oh, now popping comes with a little crunch. I guess it's a one-time use deal. Good thing there's a lot of buttons. And look, some eggs! Wow. What do you think's inside? Huh? Wait a minute, that's no egg! It's got more layers than an onion! Shrek would be proud! Oh, now it's all clear. Like a crystal ball, but not for long. Wow, it's so magical, so mystical, so broken. What was inside it anyway? It's B again! Aw, aren't they cute? Aww. F, is everything okay in there? Eh? It's A! Did the other vowels ditch you? I always thought that Y was fickle. Ew! Yuck! Ew! I'd ask, but we've seen where he's been. Ew! Don't worry, A. We can help clean you up. Let's start with your teeth. And now for the rest of you. We'll need another type of brush for this job. Yeah, really get into those pores. Or whatever letters have. Maybe we should have used baby shampoo. Good thing baby Yoda's here to help. Let's finish the job with a hot face mask. Maybe some new lashes? Of course, you're never fully dressed without a tiara. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's your color either. Oh, you just had some wool up your nose. Might as well have some fun with that. What a seamstress. Now it's letter K. Uh, something's missing. Let's give him a face while we're at it. Oh, they grow up so fast. Aww. Fly pretty fast, too. Mmm, what's inside? A baked potato? Ew. What the? Well, at least we've got all this nice foil to play with. Guess there's no hard feelings toward the LMNOP game. Those guys love a good makeover, but they usually do it Sailor Moon style. Look who's getting some big muscles, and he didn't even hit the gym. Time for the face. 
two eyes, one mouth. Let's add some dental implants while we're at it. Don't forget to add some tusks. Okay, maybe F does have a little grudge. Look, some toes, complete with nice sharp claws. For the finishing touch, devil horns. Or is he a minotaur? <laughs> this little ball's fun to play with, as long as you're not made of sand. Don't worry, we can make a new one. Is it me or is this starting to look like ice cream? You know, the best part of Parfait is the kind you squish. E and F just seem to go together, don't they? Of course, E can sometimes be a hothead. Well, that's one way to blow out your candle. Careful now, you don't want too much wax on the cake. It's X with a surprise attack. But have we got a surprise for him? Our mini shredder. Of course, we can play with it. Wow, X makes for a cute little puzzle. Guess there was enough for two of him. Oh, so that's how you make lowercase letters. Want to go for another ride? There's no line. Wow, now there are four of him. He's multiplying like bacteria. We could make more, or we could just cut them up by hand. Marshmallows? Good idea. We can make s'mores. Oh, look, it's pink. Still, you can't have s'mores without chocolate. Now all we need to do is add some heat. Much better. Nice and gooey. He is so sweet. She always looked just good enough to eat. And she always had such great taste. QRS terrific stuff. Catch you next time. Ooh, a ball! Oh, it's leaking. Let's squeeze out the slime and fill it up with Orbeez. Now blow it up big with water. Scissors? Uh-oh, I think it's gonna blow. Especially when you give it a good squeeze. Something tells me playtime's over. Eh, it was worth it. Feels gooey. So that's where I put that chocolate bar. Don't worry. A little cold, and it's solid again. Wow. Oh. And look, it even comes right off. This could use some whipped cream. And caramel sauce. And I'd never say no to sprinkles. Bon appetit. Ooh, is someone getting a new house? Please, like this video to help mom. Once again, the piggy bank saves the day. Come on in and look inside. <laughs> Not exactly a buyer's market, is it? At least you get all these boxes. Maybe mom can cheer her up with all this extra cardboard. Draw a dog and make a few cutouts. You've got a new doggy bank. 
a fun lesson about the digestive system, and a bank all in one. Truly a girl's best friend. Next, let's stack some boxes together. And soon, we've got a castle fort. But it's gonna need some furniture. And every castle needs flags. But the final touch, a princess. Uh-oh, watch out! Poor box. Let's take some cardboard and cut out some big bananas. Add some boxes to connect them. Let's paint it. Yellow, naturally. Pretty soon, it's the best seat in the house. Just make sure the paint's dry. Now let's trace your foot and punch it out. Well, <laughs> kick it out. Add a tiny border. Pretty soon, it's a whole new shoe. Just don't forget the laces. Oh, is somebody getting hungry? We're gonna need to whip up an oven. Complete with buttons on the side. Ooh, there's a turkey for dinner. And fried eggs for breakfast. How about we slice up some bread and cut some lettuce into thin slices. Well, everything sure looks nice. But I'm not so sure about the taste. Don't worry, Mama can fix it. Enjoy. Ooh, are you feeling cold? This should help. What else? Oh, inspiration strikes. Stack up some boxes. And we've got a fireplace. Take a sponge. Add some color. And bricklaying has never been easier. But a fireplace needs, well, fire. Take some colored plastic. Now let's toast some marshmallows. Wow, a candle sure comes in handy. Ew, what's that smell? Socks? Why don't we grab a box? Cut out a hole and add a bucket. Pretty soon, we'll have a new washing machine. Ooh, we can't forget the bubbles. Now let's clean those socks. Just gotta love the spin cycle. But let's keep it in the machine. You could use your own special trash bin. Remember, some trash bins have grouches. But some trash bins are grouches. Or better yet, a mean green alligator. And he's pretty hungry. Let's feed him. Uh-oh, a mouse? Think you can whip up a cat? Better yet, a magnifying glass 
fits right into this mouse hole. And we've got a new projector. Add a car, and it's a drive-in movie. Or better yet, go for a ride. Vroom, vroom. She's got a need for speed. Next up, let's cut up a cardboard circle. Until it sort of looks like a flower. Now fold in the petals. Paint every other one. And we're gonna need to make it bigger. Add some pretend water inside. And it's your brand new pretend pool. Okay, now let's towel you off. And pick you a new outfit. No? Well, looks like we need to make you a brand new wardrobe. Huh? Ooh, it's gonna need some color. Let's see if she likes them. No. Well, third time's the charm. Now let's accessorize. You look great, but the old mirror's a different story. We can fix it. Take some egg cardboard, cut out some little flowers, and keep adding petals until they're rosettes. You can make a ring around of roses. The mirror's got a new border. Cool, she's got her own drawbridge. Kind of a dark hallway. Could use some lights. Wait, Mama knows best. First, fold some paper into place. And use it to cover up the lights. Wow, books really do light up your life. And you can always read at night. Next up, stack some toilet paper roll halves. And give it a white coat of paint. Soon, you've got a tiny cloud. Complete with a rainbow running down. Uh -huh. There's even treasures inside. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> uh -huh. With a little imagination, this place has uh -huh. become a colorful new dream house. Uh -huh. <laughs> with everything you can imagine. Literally, Mom crafted everything. <laughs> Of course, this little girl's the real queen of the castle. And I'm not just talking about the fort. But more importantly, she's Mama's little girl. Looks like it's time for a shopping spree. Okay, maybe not spree. Anything on clearance? Uh-oh, someone wants a five-finger discount. Well, crime doesn't pay, but somebody has to. I'd use that one phone call on a lawyer. Okay now, give us a big smile. Friends come and go, but mug shots last forever. It's not too bad. At least there's plumbing. Maybe you'll get out with good behavior. Then again, everyone has their price. And 
We've got cleaning supplies. Ooh, a silicone brush. Let's add some soap. Let's get scrubbing. And don't forget to flush. Gotta love those bristles. Yeah, I wouldn't touch it. Hungry? Look, you've got a sandwich. And right in your cell, too. Whoops! And now you're leaking slime? Oh, this just isn't your day, is it? Well, maybe it can help clean things up. It collects all that mess for you. Hold on, you missed a spider. Now it's clean enough to eat off of. Not exactly bars of gold, are they? Don't worry, the guard has just the thing. A rag and a bucket. Wait a minute. Those marshmallows can help. Stick them on. Think we'll have enough? Well, that answers that. Um, you're eating the wrong side. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Great, now your dentures are a mess. Is there a dentist in the house? Don't worry, she's got Instamorph. Add to water and swirl it up together. Now we can mold it into shape. We just need something tooth-shaped. Like a tooth. Make sure it fits. Can't wait to try out these chompers. Try them out. Now bring on the peanut brittle. Get up! Gotta stay on schedule! And it's wash time! Wait, your makeup's not waterproof! Don't worry, you just need a shield of sorts! Place it in front of your hair. Now add some shampoo and rinse off! Your hair looks great, and so does your makeup. Lucky, she's got her own kiddie pool. But she could use a shield, too. Let's start by grabbing an old cap. This'll do. Now make a big hole on top. Try it on and wash that scalp. Just make sure it's a clean cap. You don't want your hair to get lice. Who knew prison was so boring? Life without a phone is just wrong. Hello? Where else can you watch fun internet videos? I mean, besides your computer. <laughs> what the? Oh, it's just a prank. Hello? Oh, I guess we can always read. Maybe she'll have more fun with it. But first, we need to inspect it. Wait, there's a real phone underneath. Wow. And it's already playing videos. But to enhance our experience, Grab a box. Poke a hole and place the phone inside. Place a magnifying glass on top. And we've got our very own movie projector. Show you how to make your own. 
<laughs> Careful, you'll break a nail. Oh, now what did I tell you? Oh, the key's almost in reach. And Mr. Bones is gonna help us get it. Come on, just one little femur. But what's better than an old bone? A shiny, sparkly old bone. Try to sink your teeth into this. Of course, when it comes to dogs, sinking their teeth is the whole idea. Hmm, maybe she'll have better luck. Anything under the bed? So that's what's been going bump in the night. But that chocolate can be molded into whatever we want. Like a new key. It's now or never. Let's see if it works. Uh-oh. Well, on the bright side, it's 70% cacao. Oh, everything's freezing in here, including the toilet. Let's cover the seat with toilet paper. The 24 karat kind, apparently. What's a throne without a crown? Much better. Now it's your turn. Stop, you're making it colder. I wouldn't touch that if I were you. Think, what helps keep things warm? It's socks. Well, it's the best we got. Add one sock on each side. <laughs> nice and warm. But what are we gonna do for socks? Oh, tattoos. Let's try the bag of cash. Ouch! Don't you have any temp tattoos? Ah, roll on glitter tattoos. You had us at glitter. Things are about to get sparkly. You're like a diamond in the sky. Oh, you even got a tongue tattoo. So, buddy, do you take walk-ins? Either way, you gotta pay the piper. Ooh, a coin. That gets you a pencil. Draw a shape you like on top. Now carve the eraser into the shape. It's a stamp, but it needs some ink. Good thing you stepped in paint. Wow, this girl's all heart. Talk about wearing one on your sleeve, sort of. Wow, this toy store is packed today. Look at everything. And for the piece de resistance, a doll. At this price, it better come with accessories. Ooh, she's got a little surprise for you. Okay, maybe not so little. Hey, careful! You can pay for that doll, right? Right? Well, better get comfortable. Gonna be here a while. Hey, that's contraband! Do you want ants in here? Ah, nap time! And time for us to get crafty! Ooh, a fishing rod! What's the catch of the day? A teddy bear? I would have aimed for the keys! 
But this still has potential. After all, who can say no to a secret compartment? <laughs> Nap time isn't such a bad idea either. But who can sleep when there's a chair to make over? Looks sturdy, but let's ditch the cobwebs. Time for a little advanced finger painting. Run a ribbon through the holes. Maybe some pom-poms. These bananas will make great horns. And how about a spotted pillow? For the final touch, fill a glove with slime. And add it to the bottom. Hey, you can't keep a cow in here. So who wants milkshakes? Oh, it's time for a catch-up run. In the meantime, let's stash it away. Cause you know she's up to something. Told ya, never underestimate a manicure. Not only do you get a built-in skeleton key, but you'll save a ton on silverware. Okay, that's it. We need to get out of here. I wonder where this leads to. Ah, the guard! Well, let's have some fun. Always wanted to try a fish pedicure, but now let's use that basin. Next, fold some paper like an accordion. And wrap it around the basin. Fill it up with some pillow stuffing. Now let's add some decorations. Like some sprinkles on top. Can't forget the cherry. It's the best seat in the big house. Yeah. <laughs> Always room for chocolate cake. Though I would keep an eye on it. It might not be safe around here. No! Didn't even get one slice. Hmm, maybe we can cover it up. Add all these little candies in a row. I'm sure he won't mind the change. Bakeries usually charge extra for that. There's no place like home. No place oh. like... Ah, just messing with you. You're still in jail. Uh -huh. But we can still have some fun. <laughs> Wrap this tule around a hula hoop. Hang it up and you've got a canopy bed. Ah, breakfast. So close, and yet so far. Here's what to do. Grab a hanger. Oops. And spray on some gold paint. Now draw on some hot glue. Add more hangers, a tray, and you've got yourselves a mini table. Can you still see your feet? Yeah, almost wish you couldn't. We can fix it. Just grab a broom. Yeah. Hmm, maybe that remote car can help too. First, we need to get that remote. Good. Now let's take it for a drive. Uh -huh. 
Looks like the start of a great friendship. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> now let's get cleaning. Gotta love symbiosis. I guess even in jail, you can't escape trash day. Well, maybe we can have some fun. Place one bin on top of the other. Add a lid on top. This'll do. Cover it all up with a sheet. Now put your feet up and relax. Looks like someone yeah. left a trail. Huh? <laughs> What's that noise? Uh, Another cake? Uh, How many birthdays can one guy have? <laughs> Quick, while he's out, grab some balloons. <laughs> la, 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 la. Fill up a bag, and it's a DIY air mattress. Suck out any excess air. Now catch some Z's. For a one-person cell, it gets dirty quick. Well, it's not gonna clean itself, apparently. Ooh, that is some sparkly tape. It really helps perk up the cell. What else could we add? A hoop! And a basket underneath for some trash basketball. Ooh, donuts. Can we have one? No? Now that's a cruel and unusual punishment. Well, maybe we can just make our own donuts. Can't forget the sprinkles. Wow. Make a bunch. You're eating for two. Must be take your cash to work day. Probably not the best place to leave it. Because I think she just cracked the code. The most valuable thing of all. Masking tape. can always use an extra hand around here. Why don't we decorate it? It's just the thing to hold your stuff. Wow, this just isn't her day, is it? Well, maybe we could turn this old bottle into a new lamp. Add some cotton. And it's a nightlight. This place could sure use a makeover. Hey, what's the guard up to? Maybe this straw can help. Get some string and run it through. Now add some beads. And more straws. This brightens up the room. And it's fun to play with. Looks like somebody has big news for us. She's having a baby. Congratulations. Oh, and she's in jail too. What an eventful day. Either way, you need your rest. Wait, are those bricks? First that pee under your bed, and now this. Grab your tights and fill it up with something soft to make a new pillow. Let's dress it up while we're at it. Now it's off to dreamland. Who's ready for the gender reveal party? Wow! Ooh, 
green. Uh, what does that mean exactly? I guess someone's being a wise guy. Let's try something else. Get some cheese. One for the girl, one for the boy. Now, get a rat. Okay, Mr. Rat, what's it gonna be? Looks like you're having a girl. Ooh, our new mommy could use a bathroom break. Ugh. Well, I'm not cleaning that up. Okay, we need to rethink this, and fast. Hmm, make a hole on the plastic chair. And make sure the seat is soft to sit on. Now place that bucket underneath. Strawberries. You don't buy them. You rent them. Hmm. Getting some beauty rest, I see. Guess we don't need that cold cream. Still, makeup's not easy to replace in here. Oh, great idea! Candy! Wet it a little. And then spread the color over your eyes. Now for the lips. Red is traditional. Pucker up. Ah, all made up and ready to go. If only we had somewhere to go. When they say don't let the bed bugs bite, they really weren't kidding in here. Happy birthday! Just gonna borrow this. Let's add a bunch of balloons to this vacuum bag. Now seal it up nice and tight and suck the air out. We'll need to make some room. Much better. Now it's time to relax. Okay, 99. 100! Good workout. What's next? Ooh, let's get something to drink. There's not much to drink in here. So it looks like we're going on a trip. Okay, now we're gonna need a long straw. And I mean long. Looks like there's enough juice for two. Uh-oh, he spotted us. What's he up to? Let's hope she likes salt. Just pretend it's a day at the beach. Hey, people are trying to sleep. Don't you have a home to go to? I know. Freddy Bear will help us. Just reach on back. And take out any excess fluff. Now stick two of these Freddy Bears on a headband. Can't hear a thing? Good. Nighty night. Time for a great escape. Or maybe not. I know. Let's open that lock. Just need a key. Let's try one of the others. Perfect fit. And we're out of here. Next time, let's try good behavior. Who's up for a little garden of bonbon? Hey, careful with that drink! Uh oh! That Opila bird doesn't look too friendly. 
<laughs> no, not the cage! Quick, you gotta break out! Not like that. What's going on? No humans? We need a way to trick this security system. Hmm, why don't we put that pimple to good use? Let's see if you can break the bars. No? Well then, we'll dig our way out. What? Oh, hey, did you find something? Yay! It's an Opila box. Just what we need. Let's start with this extractor. Hmm. And clear up all those zits. <laughs> But now let's clear all that dead skin. There's fresh skin underneath. And I mean real fresh. You're looking a little red in the face. You know, I hear eggs are good for skin. Especially when they come with shiny face masks. Wow, that was quick. Uh-oh, Mama's back! We're gonna need to make a replacement. Hmm, whatever this is, it's egg-shaped. It'll just have to do. Quick, make the switch. Do you think she'll fall for it? Uh, guess not. Something tells me that Opila is mad at her. Her glasses! Oh no, she can't see a thing without them! But maybe these drops can help. Or maybe not. Unfortunately, she can't read that warning. Drops aren't supposed to give you red eyes. Now she has Opila's bird vision. Ugh, pretty sure those nose hairs are new. Get some sticky gum, add to a stick, and make like you're digging for gold. Now let's toss those sticks. Great aim, just poor timing. What? Okay, what we need is a distraction. Great idea! Worms! What bird can resist? Now toss that bait. Great success. Quick, grab that other box. Wait, I wouldn't stick my hand there. Look, in the first box, plastic wrap. Lay down the wrap. Now draw out a face with makeup. Red ruby lips. Add matching eyeshadow. Just remember to close your eyes before putting it on. Yay! Might need a little pat here and there. Now peel it off. Ew! Oh, looking good! Yes! I guess everyone's getting makeovers. Oh. On the huh? plus side, Free shaving what? cream. Oh, gonna shave your head? Hmm. Yay. Wait, no, she's adding color. And lathering it up. Hmm. Now we're gonna need some help. Hey. Come on, Opila bird, take the worm. We'll pluck that feather. Uh-oh. Now those are some vibrations. Ooh, look at your new rosy locks. Now that's worthy of a hair flip. Think it'll be enough to trick the security system? Yeah. 
Guess not. Well, when a makeover doesn't work, it just what? means we're not wow. finished. Now pull on these carnival gloves. Yay! And stick on some feathers. <laughs> right down to your fingers. And why should your arms have all the fun? Hey, in back of you, something's glowing! What is it? Hmm. It looks like a drone controller. Huh? Uh, wow. You know what that means. A drone shouldn't be too far oh. behind. And while we're at it, let's pick up some chicken on the way. This is no ordinary chicken. It's a Play-Doh chicken. Ooh, wow. does it lay golden eggs? Yay! No, even better. They're clay. Which we can use to make feathers. Or better yet, a stylish new beak. Just make sure you can breathe. Anything else in the box for us? Guess not. But hey, look! It's a plastic bag! Maybe it can help. Hmm. With a few cuts, it's a brand new dress. But it's a little too simple. A little accessorizing never hurt anyone. Like a new belt. A new skirt. Yay! Preening's important when you're a bird. Feeling okay? Wow, you really are a bird. Oh, roll on glitter tattoos. Yay! Let's try them on. Stick them on and don't forget the glitter. Pretty soon, you're your own shining star. Wow! Hmm. Now let's fix up those feet. We're gonna need some new socks. Oh. Anything in yellow? Oh, and it's nice and long. It's the perfect thing for a pair of bird legs. Roll them up as high as you can. Now make some holes to hold some feathers. You'll need a little plumage for your tights. Hey. Maybe this will trick the security system. It worked! Yay. We're on our way out of here. But we're not out of the woods yeah. yet. We still have to fool the Opila bird. Hey, that worked too! Let's have some tea and donuts. Aww. Wow, she really didn't need a mouth hole. Opila bird likes a little music with brunch. Time to rock out, but not too hard. Uh-oh. Oh no! Not the eyebrows! We gotta get out of here! Oh, it was all a dream. So, who's up for some fresh air? <laughs>